Erickson, Rob, they seen they seen me being neighborly. Oh yeah. Uh, that's what you was doing. Yeah. No, when I walked, they was waiting. They got here before me because I was running around. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> yeah, don't do that. JB. <laughs> Wait, that's what they called you. That's what they called yeah. you. Yo, don't do that. Yo, you all right? Yo, they call him what? Alex, you JB. wasn't even wait, there. Wait. Alex, I ain't had a handful of What they call him? There. They call him JB. That's JB right there. Oh, that's JB. Oh, shit. My guy, Matt. Fr a... Friend of the show. He loves the show. You got a nickname? Matt, what's up? He's coming from the gym. Nigga was shirtless, walking down the hallway with me with some water in his hand. Calling you so, a nickname? Hey, what's going on? JB. Uh -huh. Yo, you think I'm Joe Budden around the whites? <laughs> wait. You might be jump bones. I don't wait, know. What, what it, wait, <laughs> wait, what did it? Wait, what did it? Wait, what did it? Ish, I jump bones. <laughs> I don't know what your little. You know what I'm saying? We done fucked enough together. Whoa, wait, hey, man. Oh, no, 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 we ain't doing we that. Fuck hey, Park, women. let's just go back to the story. Women. <laughs> women. What the fuck is up with these dudes? Women. Oh, okay. Women. Okay. Fuck you thought, nigga. I ain't think nothing. I'm just taking what yeah. you said. Words mean things. Yeah. Jump. So we fucked it up don't, together. Don't, don't uh, acronym my name again. I didn't. Jump That was balls. your man, Matt. <laughs> JB. <laughs> that was your man. You seen me over there. Where we was at? Oh, man. Where we at? You seen me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I really huh? didn't know. Huh? I really didn't know. Huh? I was doing what I was doing. I know. Oh. I got out of there. <laughs> I can't fuck when it's nasty. Huh? Wait, yes, but it's nasty. What wait, 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 wait. What's nasty? What's, the yeah, room yeah, or the sex? Yeah, the room. The room. Oh, okay. the room. Like, wait, when your surroundings. Oh, okay. Quality of fuck. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I fucked some, fuck <laughs> some, some places. I got some bullshit. I assume that about you. <laughs> and me. <laughs> you are witnessed, I think. <laughs> you are witness. You was back there with the deer. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> When all y'all niggas was fucking what's the name and tried to keep it a secret from everybody even though we was know, all in the shit. same house? No, who you Remember talking that? about? No, I don't. I do. <laughs> I did not have sexual hey. relations with that young lady. I was the last to know. Hey, see, your life would toss you signs. I was the last to know everybody was fucking her. I, who's everybody? You I did not have uh, sexual relations. Who's her? <laughs> I could go down the some, some young lady. <laughs> I can go down a list of niggas. Hey, bleep that name out, but I, yeah, you niggas was having wasn't some, me. some fun. No, they did. Oh, on my dime, I'm flying out. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Yo. Salute to you. I'm I'm always, thank you. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always get You're taken advantage of you. in these work. situations. Yeah. How you gentlemen feeling today, man? Great. Good, man. How about you? Barbara Walter-ish, huh? Give, give, me, give, me, give me some feedback. It did look a little view-ish. It looked like the view. It was dude, looking like something. Dude view. It's a nice view. Dude view. It looked like dude view. Dude view. Yeah, you know, okay. the girls got all those shows. The talk. <laughs> it looked like the talk. <laughs> you know, somebody said, That's a dope hey, Joe thing. Newsett looked like they ready to spill all the tea. <laughs> <laughs> well. Hey, they look, look, look like them niggas about to gossip their ass off over there. I mean. Uh, I mean. Kind of am. Yeah. No, it's not, it's not what we doing. The <laughs> art to podcasting is to try to do it without gossiping. Yeah. yeah. Make it objective. Yeah, Try these niggas get right. these mics and, and get the. And what did he say when you said? Mm -hmm. Did you hear this? What such and such said such a, <laughs> about you? <laughs> God, yo. Oh, uh, what would I want to start with? All right, I want to curse the internet out. Oh, Let's do it. I, I told you Come I have on. a couple. Of I want to cut reasons. I want to again. Me too. You got some too? Yeah. You go. I'm fresh back from Mykonos and I come do a pod. Even though I did take a few days off, so I understand. I wasn't all the way up on all of the news, man. So I see the little headlines, and I'm rallying with y'all because I'm, I'm black power, nigga. Man, the Quinta Brunson, Jimmy Kimmel shit, I came in here with my little Malcolm X hot takes. Mm. Quinta Brunson and Jimmy Kimmel are best friends forever. <laughs> He's mentored her. <laughs> Helped her in her career. Parks and Ice is right. Is that what y'all said? I don't be listening to y'all. No, what y'all say? I ain't say that. What they say? I ain't say, they they say they're best, best friends, friends but it's, it's, maybe we should wait to hear because it's probably some more to this that people are overreacting. That's what we were saying. I said I wanted to hear from her. I did. I overreacted. <laughs> that shit was fly. She was fly with it. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great little comedy, well, well, comedic had, sketch. If he played a part that they in her wrote success. up, because yeah. allegedly he played a part in her journey. She's amazing, though. She is. She, is. she she's amazing. Deserves all of the recognition and the accolades that are coming her way. And I even like how they um, you know, they flipped it on his show. Yeah. I love that. Yeah, that's dope. I knew she was I knew she was really her when the the season finale of Abbott's Elementary came on 
And then two weeks went by and like five more episodes. Yo, I, I watch it. I'm like, wait a I minute. Saying, I oh, thought this was over. Oh, and, you are her, her. And then mm-hmm. it's coming back again. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, they can't. Yeah. No, I mean like. No, it fam, came right back. It's hot. Yeah. It's yeah. hot. No, oh, we're not letting this sit here. No, no. Run some more. Yeah, we're not doing 10 episodes. Sorry. Nah. Let's get back in school. Get back into school. Yeah, so yeah. internet, thank you for making me sound like a fucking da dun da dun like a doof. <laughs> That's when they start questioning my journalist car. You didn't even research it. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a journalist, no. bro. No. Microphone no. check. No. One, no. two, no. what no. is no. this? No. What episode is this? 563. No. Welcome to no. episode no. 563 of the JBP. No. I'm your humble, gracious, grateful, and highly favored host, Joe Button, here with a few of my really good friends. Ish is here, Ice is here, Parks is here, Corey is here, young boys in the bed. All right, how's everybody doing? How y'all feeling? It's the weekend. What's the vibes? Where it's at? Talk to me. It's fall. Yeah, it is fall. It is fall. I I, I learned that when I did my normal slow drive by the hookah spot, thinking it was something going on. Fall, yo. Looked at so I was like, hey, it's light out here. It's 60 <laughs> degrees, Joe. Mm-hmm. It's cold now. Hoodie season, baby. I, I said, love oh, it. Yeah. Shit, we're yeah. right. It ain't out no more. Sweaters, jackets. Mm-hmm. My dumb ass ran out earlier this morning to, to the store with some shorts and a t shirt. Early. 58. It was in North. You went to the store with what? Shorts and a t shirt. You did Apple Pay? Of course. <laughs> So you pulled your phone out? No. Watch. Oh, your watch. Come on, man. Your watch don't have your same screensaver as your phone, does it? No. Your lock screen? <laughs> I never had an Apple Watch. Parks? Yeah. Does the Apple Watch come with like a lock screen? Uh, Yeah, I don't think you can put a picture up there. You can. Oh, you can? Yeah, you oh, can. Oh, my bad. You would know. You can. But you I, don't no, no, have I, one. No, I just got the, the time. So it's just one on your phone? Yeah, on my, on my watch, it's just the time, the date. Well, the time know. and the date is on your phone, too, but what else is there? Um, Also on... You know, I can control the house, the the temperature, you know. You but before we get house. into what's on your phone, let me tell you what I've learned. They said that you can't put a picture of yourself as your lock screen on your phone. I I, I agree with that. I never knew that. That's a I little think, weird. I think, yeah, I think that's very uh, I vain. I never knew that. Having a picture of yourself on your phone? That's what you have? Uh, Is it still there? <laughs> Let me see. Yeah. <laughs> and now yeah, with, it's me. Yeah. It's, it's Joe. <laughs> and now with the new shit, you could just change your lock screen with but the But what shit you have there then? Some shit. I thought the niggas that had like the forest was corny and like I brain falls. <laughs> I thought they was corny. I I, I'm the having, corn ball. It's better than having yourself. Mom. I didn't know that. But what? why? I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense because it is your phone, but it seems it's a little if weird. If you lose the phone, they know whose phone it is. <laughs> nah, because no one's going to be like, oh, this is probably Joe's. It's a picture. Well, maybe if I, lo- if I lose the phone, I don't want the, the thief looking at my fucking beautiful kids. Like, what are you talking about? I'm going to put something that, I, that really means something to me on the front. And then you can't put your girl there, but we'll get to ice in a second. You have logos. You though. can't. You could put like the JBN. Yeah, 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 man, Alex. <laughs> you can't put your girl on the phone because then niggas is looking at your girl every yeah, time yeah, the fucking lusty. phone is yeah. up. Yeah. Why are niggas looking at your phone? What if your girl look good? Why are niggas looking at your phone? Huh? Why are niggas looking at your phone? You left it Stop somewhere. it, Ice. Yeah. Stop it, Ice. Left, oh, I'm just. Okay. Well, you think I'm pussy again? <laughs> Again, who said you're supposed yeah, to the first? You got time? about eight pods are coming in here saying, <laughs> "I'm not y'all. Stop trying to make me be like oh, y'all." Yeah, you right. got you know, about you eight did pods. That. You I got about eight on a pods roll in a row. I d- Fam, yeah, and I'm if start- y'all agree on something, why do I gotta agree or be lying? You, don't, you do this shit too. Wait, you don't. You don't have to agree, but why do you have to frown or talk down upon? I whatever don't we do say? that either. Y'all be like, I'm a real I, man, I, like no. you niggas. Y'all want to really talk? No, this is like, yo, I hate when he come in here with his pod ish book. Yeah, you are. There's a potish. Oh, don't man. do that. That's don't do that. There See? is. A, and don't then do when that. I reply, I'm the bad guy. No, there is a potish. I didn't know. But it's not just have... ish though. Everybody has I'll, a pod. I'll just gonna for sure. We all got a pod. I think my pod demeanor is probably at the lowest though. But everybody has a pod. Demeanor, All these demeanor and what? In pod you versus you you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, yeah. you, you, Oh, we you, talking. No, we no, cooking no, you, now. You you uh. Oh, we cooking now. No, you're you're good. Yeah. No, you're good. It's tough for people, not just people here, but people in front of a camera, no. period. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. it's tough. I it's agree. tough. Very I know tough. it's tough. I agree. That's why I don't bother with trying to do it. Like no, this. you, you, uh, remember Cat Williams was talking about, uh. Give us an example. No. 
This guy, man. They on his ass. What, look, what, <laughs> yeah, what, go ahead. Yeah, bro. They remember, on, they <laughs> on his ass about example. Yo, give us an example. Of what you nah, mean? Remember, Cat Williams was talking about Will Ferrell. <laughs> yeah, and he was like, Will Ferrell do whatever he got to do to humorize the crowd. Yeah, or, yeah. Right. or to make the crowd laugh. Mm-hmm. That's what you'll do. You do whatever you got to do for the pot. If yeah. you got to get up in the name of content, yeah. yeah. If you got to tap dance on the table to make motherfuckers yeah, laugh and, and entertain the people, that's what you'll do. Yeah. I mean, it's a little expensive table, I think. You yeah. break right through that thing. I wouldn't recommend it. I mean, I wouldn't. Nah. Not that table. Not that table. The couch, though. Nah, nah I wouldn't do it on that couch. couch either. Either. You could just do it right on the floor. Yeah, just stand up on the carpet and do it. Yeah. I don't think I understand what you're saying yet, though. Like, give me another example. <clears throat> This nigga's an asshole. <laughs> he was really looking for it too. <laughs> he had a serious face on. No, he had one. one. I did. I would have found one though. But this <laughs> nigga's an ass. Yeah, he was looking for another yeah. example. This, this guy is the greatest yeah, in the world. Yeah. Yeah. I it love our fans. Yo, <laughs> yeah, you see what the nigga tweeted me this morning? No. <laughs> Wait, I got to read it. I shouldn't have retweeted it, but I'm you phony. You retweeted it? Yeah, that was hilarious. <laughs> nigga said, uh, I missed when Joe Budden was the A-mic and didn't let Ish repeat himself and give a million examples that nobody asked for every fucking pod. <laughs> for me, when you do that, that's like halftime for me. Right. That's yeah. like a break. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, get, no, your, get, get your shit off. Let him go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm chilling. All right, come on. Where do we start? I have something that touched my soul when I read it. It triggered me. It's important as a man to recognize your triggers. Okay. And that is that for me was Tom Brady's wife's uh, quote after the Bucks game. I guess she did an interview and all of these quotes are coming out. But this quote in particular, let me find it because this hit me and I'm sure it should hit you guys. Mm-hmm. It was basically about all the sacrifices that she's made mm-hmm. uh, for the marriage and for him to be, a, be the football player that he is. Mm-hmm. And you can't play football without giving 100% of your time and your devotion to it and like, it'd be nice to have you around the kids. Yeah. It'd be nice for you to be a little more present. And he seems like he's a little bit of a, uh, uh OCD with the workouts and the nutrition and with all that type of shit. just the job in itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like Film room. You Sh- know what I'm Shady saying? said it. Yeah. This, look. It's hard quote, to turn that off. This is a very violent sport. And I have my children and I would like him to be more present. Boy, that says a lot. That says a lot as to what's on her mind. She don't know how ultimately, quick releases. Ultimately... I feel that everybody has to make a decision that works for them. He needs to follow his joy too. That's the equivalent of you going out and your wife saying, have fun tonight. Mm -hmm. Like she don't really want want you to have fun. Oh yeah. At all. Everybody got to do what they got to do for themselves. It sounds like she's saying, He's made his decision. True. This was only heavy for me because the topic itself be heavy. When two people are in a relationship, married or unmarried, but you're in the same household, combined incomes, children, mm. you have to, your lives have to become mm. one now. Mm-hmm. So maybe, maybe this is mansplaining. And I get her point. because Her yeah. point is unique, though. But go ahead. She's right in her point. Is she right expressing it to new new media outlets? At this point, I think. Yeah, I think what happened was um, they got on her because typically she's at the games. Mm-hmm. And then she sent out a tweet before the game mm-hmm. and was like, uh, go, go, go Tom. Tom. Go Tom. Yeah, yeah. Just, just go Tom. And they was like, wow, that was blah. So now, of course, whenever she jumps in front of a camera, they're now going to say, yo, what's going on with y'all? And he also missed the week, the last two weeks of training camp. Yeah. For a family, for a family, issue, you know just saying. just family time. Yeah. So, I'm on both of their sides. Of I'm this. On, me too. So no doubt. for them to me, um, it's a little different because money ain't really at the center of it. Yeah. You, you get Not what I'm saying? Anymore. So yeah. for right, most right. men, for either of them, no. For most men, yeah. it's kind of like yo, you're gonna sacrifice one it, or the it's other. It's time versus money. Yeah. She got it. But that's why this is so interesting to me because that little fact is. Out of here. This has nothing to do with money. It's fascinating because no matter what tax bracket you're in, you can't escape this between you and your partner. That's why it's fascinating. I would be on his side if it wasn't those two. He don't need money, and she got a shitload of it. It's his passion. Yeah, Yeah, this is what he does. I know. It's like when when your girl tries to dead the fun. Whatever you do on the side for fun. What is he now, 45? Yep. 
44, 45, something like so that. Now I mean, that's the other thing. Like, though, I'm only going to be doing this for, even right now, right. it's way too long. If I'm just, if I'm his wife. standards. If I'm his wife. I'm leaning more on her side now. No. If I'm his wife. You're saying, yo, damn, fam, I took a back seat for a good 20 joints for you. Mm-hmm. And nobody's ever played quarterback this long, though. And yeah. you are in an extremely you, violent you, sport. That part, like you, he got a quick you, you getting hit and shit. He don't get hit a lot. He don't yeah, get hit. Yeah, <laughs> that thing's don't. out of there. But still. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm with her. Got, I look, I, I get it. I'm get with it. her. Because now it's about, yo, fam, you kind of being selfish. We Who's want being you, selfish? Him. Tom Brady is. Yes. 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 I don't know if I agree with that. Bro, I'm ready it, to argue a little bit. It kind of is. I'm ready to argue is. a little bit. It kind of is. Yo, fam, I rock you with you that. for 20 joints. I don't want to just sit around at the at home. I'm I'm retired at 45, 46 years old. I don't want to do that. Go play golf. Cool. You can still see my hat. Football my, requires a hundred, like you said, a hundred percent. You're traveling. You're this. You're that. Speech. Like you're practicing. Oh, like. It ain't just a Sunday or a Monday or a Thursday. Have to it's, your yeah. it's, it's your life. It's your life. You have to life. commit to that. You can't and eat a certain you way. Say. You yeah. can't drink, party yeah. a certain way. You can't have sex a certain way. I'm not saying sit home. And we had Shady on the thing and said, yo, four hours. Tom Brady spends X, Y, Z amount of hours just watching film. You right. know Tom you is got, Kobe. I Rest think he, in right. peace. Yes. Yeah. Right. First yeah. one yes. in, last one out. He yeah. got how many Obsessed. kids? Three, right? I'm not sure. I think it's three. Fam, you have to devote some time to your fucking family. Can I ask you something? Was Jerry Buss selfish? Yeah, I think, but I think it's different. Explain it to me. I think it's different. I think, um, and I bring it up because it's documented that his vision was to build this for and, my and, family and, and my kids. Yes, mm-hmm. and, that, and that's why I think the difference is lie. I think Jerry Buss had a vision. He sacrificed everything he had to make that vision come to fruition, and he wasn't necessarily successful. In that until later. Well, nah, because the Lakers picked up in the early 80s. Yeah. But Tom Brady he plays found a quick success. Yeah. Tom Brady's playing a sport. Can I counter your point? Shoot. Oh. oh. Go ahead. Where the difference is Jerry Buss could go home. Tom Brady's out on the road for I think that's weeks the part. and weeks mm-hmm. and weeks at a time. And he's missing from his family. You're not seeing your kids grow up. You're not with your wife. Fam, like, I'm her. She ain't no bump on the log house mom that he is taking care of they have enough money and resources to do anything now we basically saying football over your family i don't want to micro this one of course there will be subtle differences True. like mm-hmm. one can go home and one cannot mm-hmm. i'm talking about the macro point of sacrifice and having a vision for my family and what and what goes into having to do that so my point so my response to you is this is this is why i don't really view them different I believe the Tom Brady Miami Dolphin rumors. Every one of them. Yeah. I could believe I believe them. Too. I could believe them too. And if I'm to believe that rumor, your family is in your mind when you're making that type of move. And for the audience, the rumor of, yo, I'm gonna play over here for a year and then I'm gonna shift to the front office slash owner mm-hmm. position. Yeah. And that's the big distinction, because now I'm not playing. Right, now I'm not but playing. But I'm still involved in football. I can still mm-hmm. get so, my shit on. So if I'm Tom mm-hmm. Brady, listen to me, Ish. No, listen to me. If I'm Tom Brady, and you're my wife, and we've, you've already sacrificed 18, 19, 20 years. If I'm Tom, I'm saying, yo, one, two more years of sacrifice changes everybody's lives. Everybody's lives. That's where I think the selfishness is kicking a little I, bit, though. And I disagree with but you. But damn, how much... I, because, Joe, they're not... Damn, your little, your little football greatest quarterback in the world money is very different from the type of money that we're talking about when it comes to being an owner. Yeah, it is. But she got it. She don't have it she like don't an got owner. Like that, yeah. she, she don't, don't, got owner she don't have it like that. She don't have it like that. And but, that's why I think Tom wait, 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 is looking wait, wait. like... Why? But Tom is looking at it different now, I think. Dog, they both a couple hundred M's up. Yeah. Right? That's safe to say. Yeah. They both are a couple. So they both read the newspapers when these uh, headlines come out about athletes that made a billion dollars. True. Wait, wait, wait. Let me finish. Mm -hmm. So now we are both a couple hundred men. uh, If you're her, in her perspective, fam, you are missing your kids growing up. Fuck that money because the money. Yo, when you. What's the. Hear me first before y'all jump on me. Yo, if you got seven, eight hundred million. Uh Uh-huh. And you got four billion. Uh-huh. What are your kids going really? What's the difference in your kids' lives? Huge difference. I disagree. It's a huge difference. It's a huge difference. I think it's a huge. It's a huge difference in terms of what they inherit. True. I said in your kids' in lives. Their lives. Yes. The difference is 
now your kids' kids' lives are strict. Mm-hmm. And that's the difference. They straight up seven, eight hundred million too. When Stop you, re- it, Joe, you retiring in your forties, and the world is still it's, your there's oyster. There's a big difference between five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred million, and a few bees. Sure, but not when you forty something. Why not? Because in your forties, you still are capable of reaching the bees. He, Derek Jeter, retired and bought a team. Tom Brady, and he ain't have Giselle on his hip. Mm-hmm. She got money, money. So all of those things are still capable of being attained if he retires tomorrow. Right, out of football. You don't have to play football. He don't still football. have to do that. Says you. Says you. Even if I'm believing. History shown it. If I'm believing, I'm, only, I'm going off speculative reports. If I believe the Miami story, then, yeah, yo, come play for us for a year. Mm-hmm. Give us that. Mm-hmm. And then we'll give you. I go through it not to that level, of course. In 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 my business, mm-hmm. they want to do other shit. But yo, could you please just give us a show? Sit down, give us something. Just give us something. That's what they do. It's the trade. I'm just you. saying, if I'm Tom, I'm too close. I'm too close to that different. It's like Hove. It's like if Hove would have damn not to bring up Hove. It's like if he would have stopped before he saw all those barriers that he would have had to break for the next man to be able to go through it. I don't think it's selfish. You keep saying I. It, it and everything you are saying, you're I, I, saying I think we're making you're selfish the one that a bad got, thing. It's still, it can be selfish. It's still I, selfish. I think you. So I, there's a way to be selfish and still consider others. I think that for them, yes, they have. A, I say oh, yes. they have an alternate yes. route. hundred percent. Yeah, I think they have an alternate route. Because I don't, I don't, I don't want to spin this around. I just thought this was super interesting. No, it's dope. It's a dope. It's a dope thing. I think that they're unique in that most people, um, in Tom Brady's field. That's the breadwinner, right? So I think their situation is unique because she got it. Mm -hmm. Uh And I'm saying, fam, we could go get it another way with you being present. She don't got it if I'm about to get a billion or two billion or three for access to that type of money. You don't have it. This shit is cool. I think it's an alternate route. I don't think it's just that one route that that puts that that, that space. They they could potentially still get that two, three billion. Without retiring right now because you're only 45 years and t- old. And watch this. No, look. Now, so take it from this. And this is a personal space. Take it from this. Those two or three years that you're saying, hold up, hold up, hold up, they're vital in your kids' lives. Take it from me because I'm the one missing them. You get what I'm saying? So I'm missing those two and three years. You saying, yo, hold up, two, three, four years. Those are vital when you got three kids and a wife at home. And we don't need it. I don't want a wife that's going to tell me no if I'm this close to fucking, if I'm this close to. Uh, but and also, same, I mean, if we're going to call Tom a little bit selfish for this, you could say that she's being a little yeah, selfish for this because she wants a little bit more Giselle time. Giselle Bunchkin is a Brazilian supermodel. Hold kids. up, Ish, Ish, pardon me. Giselle, Giselle Bunchkin is a Brazilian supermodel who has a net worth of $400 million. That fortune is separate and independent from her husband, Tom Brady's two fifty. Combined, they not at seven hundred, yo. Yo, don't talk a hole in my head if I got billions for uh, me and my entire family to get to. Let me go get to it. Let me go get to it. So she, don't annoy me. Time out. You're bugging. Because she could have said that. She could have said, nigga, I'm the biggest fucking model on the planet. I'm going to keep my career moving. Don't fucking annoy me. I didn't. I put my career on the back burner for you. For the family. In the family. I could have still been on stages on catwalks getting money. I didn't. What do that have to do with my decision making? She had you this made that decision for Every, us for the collective, uh, and now you won't it. make I'm it. Not, I'm, stop it, yo. Okay, cool. You did that. Yeah, that thank, does not thank mean you. I have yeah, that to don't do mean that. I have to do that. That don't mean I'm, I have to. That's see all it I'm that saying. Way. I'm disagreeing. I'm not disagreeing. that I have to. True. I could understand that. And True. okay, cool. You did that. That was your decision. I'm, I'm you know what? I, I'm willing to walk away from mine right now. But that does not necessarily mean that at so look, same, when it when it when it flips back around bruh, that you gotta be and, and, you that, walk and away. that's where that's the only thing that I disagree and with. And that's where some people have a disagreement in business and in team building. Because the same sacrifice that I'm willing to make for the team, nigga, you should be willing to make too. And then and something like that needs to be discussed ahead of time. You need and to know what side y'all att- stand on. You we should can't be able get to, to that point. This. You can't get to that point and say, yo, well, look, well, gotta, I did this. I gave this gotta, up for you. You got to give me more. You have to do it for me. You got to give me more. Off mic, I will. You got to give me more. Off yeah. mic, I will. Because again. He, he's too close. He's too close to a different My thing is, of, I understand if, if where I'm she's if, coming if from. One man, I get it. Oh, me too. I get me it too. because, uh, again, it's you're not playing golf. It's football. 
Change. One if little one, one if little. one man make one or two more moves for another one or two years, no Brady for the rest of life will have to do. So like you could just say I, different shit. I can't call that person selfish. It may look I, selfish. It is selfish, Joe. Based on but what it's selfish because those things be in- for inaccurate the, for, for down the line benefit. Those it's still things, selfish though. Those, those things are inaccurate. and it's not guaranteed. Them net worth things are inaccurate oftentimes. Yeah, true. But let's go. We gonna go by that because that's the only thing that that's we true. have. Right. Don't be right? They're saying she's worth four hundred. Yeah. Oh yeah, it could be wrong. She has not modeled in fifteen years. She worth four hundred, and I've been off the job for the most part in fifteen years. Nigga, I'm one or two moves away from getting it too. And I put them to the rest for the betterment of our family. You need to do the same thing. See, and can you, can Again, you, can, I got to disagree with can, that. Because you're not one or two moves away today. You, I am. Yeah, I know. I could have been though. Great. Let's talk about it over dinner. True. But I let's mean, talk I'm about sure it over have. dinner I'm when sure I'm they... when I'm a few billion, a few bees up. If I'm Tom Brady, I'm not going to keep looking at LeBron headlines. <laughs> I'm not going to keep looking at Tiger Wood headlines. But Sean McCoy came in here and told us some damn stuff about them athlete niggas be looking at the different headlines. Yeah, you yeah. think I'm going to keep seeing LeBron? I just read the Bleacher Report breakdown of all his businesses, what they all worth, his road to trying to become an owner to the Vegas team and how he's been mm-hmm. plotting on that for the last 10 years. These sports niggas have to think out of the box Outside, now out. if they're not trying to think Off the field. They got to think off the field. Mm-hmm. Think off so, the field. That's true. Yeah, man. I kind of... And you know what I don't like now that I'm just exposing myself <laughs> <now>. <laughs> You know what I don't like? Most men got to leave that. That's a sacrifice, yo. Sure. We're, we're sad. We're sad when we miss the kid's graduation. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Or when we miss our kid's first haircut right. or second or third or first that's walk true. to school. Then we're sad. Nobody wants to do that. Right. That's true. It is a sacrifice. True. Mm-hmm. So when women throw that part in your face, yo, it's time now. It's time now. You missed, you missed a lot. You're missing more. It's time. Get home. It's like that. I'm already. That's already it's, one of my. When I'm you, fucked when up we about both that. Up, yeah. Joe, I, I look that at, sacrifice don't have to be made. Yeah. Right Yo, you now. think niggas? Do, you y'all think niggas stop liking money? But when, when when they up, why y'all no. keep saying that to no. me? No, because, my, because it's not, it's, you up, think they don't aspire to make like, more? I didn't no, say they do. like it. You can always aspire to make more, but it's. I'm talking about when a nigga that's making them sacrifices because it's necessary. It needs and wants. We are different, need Joe. this. We needs we, and wants are different. I'm trying to get us out of it. Yes, the hood or out of here. Out of, like, oh, it's so a let's fucking game. throw mamba mentality in the toilet. If I'm going by what y'all are saying, yeah, no, that sounds crazy. Yeah, stop it. <laughs> I don't understand what y'all are saying. That sounds crazy. I, I, my thing is needs and wants are different. So when you sacrifice certain shit because you need right to, I understand what y'all are saying. It, Me too. Because you want to. They are different. And I think, I'm just I think not once you going start to sit on the fucking couch at 45 years old. Yo, because, but you don't got to go to that extreme. You taking them out the league yeah, to the couch. That's, that's the part he don't have to be on the couch. You got to be sitting home same, all day. The same thing with Joe saying, like, yo, fam, we can still reach a couple Bs. Uh-huh. Maybe the route is different. We can still reach a couple Bs because the route that Joe is saying then, is but, not guaranteed. But, then, but, hold on, hold on. but I also then, don't want to do that. Then and I'm we rich just, and I'm him. I don't want to do that. So we have a wife and three kids. That you, you got a wife and three kids that you got to consider in that. It's not just about you being him and you don't want to do that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wanted hold on. to get off the catwalk and she Brothers. did. <laughs> Yo, didn't we just talk about Tom Brady getting like some crazy offer to, to commentate games? That yes. Just, like it's shit he can still do in football. I forgot that, Ice. I forgot that. They offered him two fifty. If that was your response to this, then you're not understanding my, my conversation. You're not getting the fact that what we what we say. Uh, yeah, I think it's selfish. It, we don't, we could we could move. Yo, on. you the know second, what's funny? No, I don't want to move on yet. Okay. We was just talking about Wendy's. Yeah, yeah. We was just talking about Wendy's and them the, up in the. the, the you told the, me twenty dollars an hour. And, 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 I, all, I didn't know where, And the Wendy's people making forty thousand an hour. Right, and, I, and I'm and I'm I don't know nothing. So you was telling me how great that is, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, and I was that's saying, great. why is that great? And you explained and I to said me that what some people graduating college is at forty two, forty three thousand dollars a year as your entry level salary out of college. And I shit, not for nothing. What? I had a friend that just came home, and those people, you know, people with F's on their record usually can't get no type of job, but a McDonald's or something like that. He came so home. For you to I'm not done. getting into yeah. the Wendy's okay, topic. Okay, okay. I'm just bringing no, it up right saying. now. So for forty grand at Wendy's, that is great. I, I asked you. What were they making? Seven, eight dollars. Yeah, nothing. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm. That's what I want to highlight. Cool for everybody. What at, at whatever tier you are, tax bracket you are, or whatever you make. If you make one dollar and now you have an opportunity that you didn't foresee to make twenty, thirty, forty, 
I see the look on your face. I know for me, when I made $10,000, $20,000 a month, or when I got a $100,000 check from the label, boy, was I excited. But when the other checks started to come, I remember that feeling. Mm. Me and Ian laughed. Fucking, I used to, hey, is it coming next month? Is it coming next month? Joe, that's just <laughs> what you make now. <laughs> like, I know that feeling. I'm looking at Kobe Bryant and how he handles everything that we've seen. I'm looking at Tom Brady and how he handles everything that we've seen. I'm trying to imagine those gentlemen that are five, six, seven hundred up presented with an offer from Bezos or Jerry Jones or somebody yeah, that takes figures. that takes you from, from that, to that to 10, 11 figures is all I'm trying to imagine. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, the broadcasting thing was the biggest deal in, in the world. If that's where I'm seeing myself. Sure. But mm-hmm. I don't think that's where Tom Brady is seeing for another 400 mil. I've been making that for the last however long through my stocks and my investments and this. I need a jump. And if I'm that close to a jump, I would like my wife to just give me a little more support, even if it seems like you're at the end of your rope. Only ask her for a year or two. That's the other part. That's a long year or two. Yeah. I understand that. I understand. We don't, Yo, we I, a long year or two. That, that's why I'm not yeah. saying that because I feel her. In a sport. I feel her. And everything in Joe's saying sport, that's what I. she's saying. Yo, you're playing. That's why it's selfish. Everything Joe's saying And that's where it becomes selfish. One. And we don't know how many two. Yo, just give me two more years. He might have oh, said. Sure, it's, I'm sure it's been a lot. This might be his, already. This might be his third. Yo, give me two more years. Yeah. And And again, he's right with regards to perception. Like, Right now, if somebody came and gave me a hundred grand a month, I'm like, I'm up, up. Mm-hmm. Right. It's some niggas a hundred grand. A, don't get them out of the bed. Mm-hmm. So it's from your level of pers- per- perspective. For sure. I'm, agree- I'm agreeing with you. But when you start to factor in the other people that are being affected by your absence, that is where the eye has to go play somewhere. And see, that's why that's where I understand the other point of that argument because. I am factoring the other people because if I make this jump, who said I, I looked at all? That's why I'm making the jump for the jump, rest of the people. Who says that jump can't be made collectively with both of us? That I don't know, and it's hard to say too because but, we don't know if she's got a plan that he's ignoring. You know what I mean? There could be some yeah. valid, like, yo, I got this scheme right here. This, you know what I mean? It's all mapped out right here. This will work. And he's like, nah, fuck that. I don't want to play football. And yeah, I absolutely would see her point. You know what I don't like about y'all? Yo, what? What, what, what are the points? This was the pod shit I'd be talking about. Because I feel like if you were thrust into that same situation, <laughs> man, nobody in the universe is getting you away from you that close to a couple bees. Your kids gonna come crying and say, Dad, 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 Get your little. <laughs> if you don't go cut it, please, iPad. <laughs> get your little ass out of here and let me go get this bee. Yo, your man, girl gonna come in, ah, man, you really doing this again? Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm doing it again. It's what not, you about to do? It's not possible. Will you be here when I return or are you out and you packing up the house? Let me know. <laughs> I'm still going to get this B over yeah, here. Yeah, you fucking right. You're wild, Sorry. Wild. You're wild. Sorry. I know. Yo, I'm wild. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Yo. Wildin' look good with a couple Bs. <laughs> They say that about now. Yo, Joe is wow. I be chilling. It's <laughs> <laughs> like yo, Joe, the fuck that nigga's with the bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> That's what y'all thought was wild. Shit, <laughs> oh, yeah. nah, nah I, shit. I, the wild one was cheap then. I disagree. Yo. <laughs> no, I mean, stand all right, that. we unpack. We, yeah, we, we can. We can stay yeah. two Give me times. an example okay. <laughs> of anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on. Let's 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 go to some more shit. Oh no, buddy! How did, how did I forget? You got me. You got me. You got me to forget. I'm getting old. Smoke. Yeah. No. 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 Your lock Slip. screen. I slipped it. Yeah, he tried it. I, I, I thought I slipped it. Your lock. Your lock screen, sir. I told you, bro. It's the no, weather. no on your phone. The, Come on, the phone lock, lock screen. screen. What's on nice. your? You got your girl on your phone? Some weather on your phone. Bright, yeah. Brighten up your day? Yes. <laughs> Aww. 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 You don't know which question I was answering. Was I answering Ish or Joe? No, nah, Brighten up. Either one is a fairy sound for me. <laughs> <laughs> Either one is crazy. Man. Why do you love birds? Nice. This nigga's oh a God. bird. I'm a fan of yours. I just want to, you know. And he's a fan of hers. So. Evidently. I am. Sheesh. Oh, How'd that happen? And how long did it take? Did she put it on your phone? A week? No, she didn't. She didn't nah, did she it. request it? How long? No. It was a picture I liked, and I was just like, Yo, yeah. But then you hard. left, you left the phone face up in front of her to see it. That's a fact. Does she know she's there? Yeah, she know. How uh, she know? Because I got the charger shit, the MagSafe shit that sits up when it charges. So she saw it while. So it was it's charging. like a portrait of her sitting up. 
when, yeah. you, when you charge it's like the like an call. NFT. A, f- a five by NFT. seven. A five by seven in your book show. Six, six. I got the big iPhone. Is it the one? Is shit. it the picture you think she's the most beautiful in? It's one of them. Oh, she beautiful in all of them, right? No, I don't see you. Put your hand down. <laughs> <laughs> no, please. Put, no, put your hand down. Let it go. No, 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 no. Put your hand down. How, how long did that take? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Seventy-two hours. It might have been less than that. 48 hours. I'm, I'm quick. You rushed to the girlfriend phone on the locks? I rushed to the girlfriend everything, bro. I rush. I, I'm a seven-minute nigga. I rush everything. <laughs> hey, yo, it's, what does somebody all have to do? I think your girl on your lock screen is way worse than yourself on your lock screen. Let me just put that out there. I, I concur. That's crazy. I don't care what y'all think. I don't know. <laughs> Even though I have had my girl as my lock screen. Yeah. I just want to know how long that takes. To put it up there, it's about a couple seconds. You take the picture. No, how you, long? Oh, oh. How long have you? I took it off once I seen niggas staring at my phone. I was like, all right, that's disrespectful. How long does it take <laughs> for your your girl to get lock screen status? No matter. I don't know. Ain't no. Are limit. you are you on her lock screen? That's a better question. I don't know. I don't look at her phone. Wow. Wow. What? She don't she don't put it on the back safe too. She don't have a back safe. Uh, this nigga just get more loserish as he keeps talking. <laughs> you don't know what's on her phone lock nope. screen. Nope. I don't know. All right, dog. <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> Talk about when she call you, do it say like daddy up there with your face? Daddy. <laughs> da- yeah, I've the- had that before. I don't- like Man, somebody put When she it, calls me, face. oh, you saying when I call her? Yeah. Yeah. Why what are you would saying I her call phone her has? while I'm right next to her to know what's on her phone? Maybe she lost her phone. Maybe he lost his mind. I know what I'm. I, maybe he lost. I know his, what it is. I'm just fucking with y'all, but you know. maybe he lost his balls. <laughs> yo, Damn. I'm listening, yo. Well, we know he lost his balls. We better hurry. <laughs> Officially, yeah. oh man, hey, fuck all three of y'all. Officially, the way. iceless. This is oh, crazy. that's what happened before you before you get clipped. You got to put your girl on your lock screen. <laughs> make sure you're part. serious about yeah, it. Yeah, make sure, make you, sure your balls. Make sure you're really not a, not a real man okay no more. Okay, we're losing your balls. <laughs> <That's> crazy. <laughs> Yo, how'd you know that? Huh? How'd you know he had that? Because he told us. Oh, no, uh, on his lock screen? He saw the mag safe. <laughs> <laughs> no, he said it casually like he didn't say nothing wrong. I didn't. I don't care what you niggas think. Evidently. I would have talked to you. I'm about. proud of you, Ice. No, you wouldn't. You can't talk How me fast out of a decision. Do you change it when y'all argue? Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, see, the new God. shit, you can swipe and change it. So, oh, yeah. My. The new shit, you just hit the button and swipe it. Yeah. My logo pops up. So, you get emotional? And Very. Just, oh, man. Like, I'm human. So yes. I'm, so, I'm going to take you off my screen. Yup. 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 See, this is why it's hard. What y'all be fighting about? You working too much? You won't retire? Oh. <laughs> no, no. You, no. Say there. Um, this ain't no, grill right ice. No, no stay, nigga. Stay with, that's the we one. have we have our disagreements. Tell me about any tell other me couple. About, yeah, since you want to be on Giselle team, Giselle, tell me about when y'all girls tell y'all y'all working too much. Every man has had it all the Definitely. time. Tell me your position in that one, Mister Macho Giselle man. It's gonna sound like oh, I can tell you. My it's gonna position. sound terrible. I know it's, you like the right. You want them four vacations, okay, five then. vacations a year? Fuck up. Oh, All right, Giselle. And that's my point. You can't hold the money overhead like y'all do. Okay. I, look. <laughs> that's a little foul. <laughs> me, that's a little foul. <laughs> look, look. Hey, yo, dog. Oh. Me working this oh, much that's... entitles you to certain, spot, certain well, that, shit? Well, that's controlling. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. I'm not telling wow. you what to do. No, listen. Oh you're t- Other no, than no, get no, off no. my back about Stop, certain yo. shit. That's it. Stop, right. Stop yo. No, you're Joey saying shit, yo. I don't want you to work so much. Okay, cool. Well, then I'm not going to be able Explain to do this. Explain to me how we can live the same standard of living. Maybe there's another way y'all could do it, and it'd be the longer <laughs> yeah, route. Investment. Explain. I'm open. Look, I'm open. I'm open to Investments. listening. Investments. I'm open to listening. Come on, go yeah, invest. No, come show. See show countertops me. and shit. Yeah, show me. You going to yeah. stop building them houses? No, you got a countertop company? I'm with it. Yeah, yeah no. you got to show Until me the other way. Sit your ass yeah. down. I rest my case. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here. This guy's he tried it. He tried it, though. You are a boy. You know, Ish don't got no picture of his girl in his phone, probably. <laughs> Why you think that? Because you don't know how to work it. <laughs> oh, man. Yo, if Flex don't get out my DM, I'm talking about this Flex challenge. <laughs> oh, he about to call you out next? Oh. Yeah. Uh, hey, Flex. Yeah. Hey, Flex, call him out. Yeah. Hey, I've been thought that you rappers was doing it wrong, might I add. Flex get on the radio, challenge y'all, call y'all out, and then y'all deliver a record two to three days later, cutting off the promo. 
I wouldn't give this nigga record to seven months. <laughs> Drag it out. <laughs> I would lose that challenge. So it's yeah. coming. Yes. I'm working there. I lost. Scream Annou- at me every week. Announced that I lost. <laughs> and I got 12 joints in the tub waiting for me to mm-hmm. drop this fire. Flex right. playing Big Daddy Kane records, Busta Rhymes records. <laughs> he got all these records. All right. What else is, is funny? Drake versus Fontano. Yeah, y'all gotta, y'all gotta oh, bring man. me up to speed. Oh. <laughs> You know who Fontana is? No. Fontano is? No. Uh, Fontano. He does the reviews on YouTube. He reviews albums. Yeah, he, and, and he's, and he's kind of good. He's good at it. I he like, is good. I like no, him. He's a man. He's, he's, okay. He, I like he runs him. that uh, review shit. Got it. But apparently he's not the biggest Drake fan. Yeah, he's been hard on him apparently in the past. Reviews. <laughs> review us. Did, did he review this last project? Probably. I would imagine. Was I, it a favorable review? Probably Probably not. not. <laughs> Probably not. So anyway, Drake has been DMing this gentleman Mm -hmm. or has DMed him in the past about his reviews. So Fontana spoke about it and he posted DMs, but they were fake DMs. (laughs) He he posted. Allegedly. No, these were fake. Fake. Dan, let me find the fake ones because the fake ones was hilarious. Okay. (laughs) It was was Drake saying, Dan, I got to find it. Alex, you find it. Yeah, I got you. It was... uh, Drake allegedly saying, yo, I've seen your reviews on my albums. Clearly, you're not the fondest of my art. I still wanted to message you to teach you how to, uh, to give you this vegan apple pie recipe. <laughs> <laughs> Some shit. And then it's mad different instructions. It's, it's the recipe. Right, right. The whole recipe. <laughs> Hopefully, you enjoy this more than you would. Like, whatever the fuck he said. You. That's hilarious. Yo, so that's that was funny. That is funny. That's so funny. then Drake saw it and posted the real DMs, which was just as funnier. I mean, just as funny. The real Wait, should I read the fake one first? Yeah, that's yeah. the fake one. Yeah, yeah I'm reading one. the fake one. Oh, man. The fake one says, Anthony, it's Drizzy. I know we don't really see eye to eye about music and that you're not the biggest fan of most of my albums. Thanks for the kind words on Take, take Care and if you're reading this, though. But it is what it is, you know? Can always hope you'll like the next one. But I'm not messaging you about your videos. I'm actually messaging you because I found a really great vegan cookie recipe and I'd love you to try it. <laughs> okay, here it is. Ingredients. He sent the mad ingredients, mm-hmm. instructions, mad shit. And then he ended with some slick shit that I don't see here because Alex is trash. <laughs> but the real DM, just as funny, mm-hmm. Drake says, your existence is a light one. And the one is because you are alive. God. And because you somehow wifed a black girl. I'm feeling a light to decent one on your existence. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I think that was a one on a scale of one to ten, perhaps. It was the number one. Yes. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. He's, he's saying, rating he one to a, he's a light He didn't one. say your existence he, was a light one. He's he rated, said, yeah. A light, no, the number one. The number one. A one. But on, barely a on one. On the scale of life. You, you are, are a one. I, I, you are a one. A light one. You ain't even a heavy one. You a light one. A light one. And that's because you are alive and you got a black wife. <laughs> <You're>, <laughs> damn. <laughs> so if you ain't have a black wife, you would be like a, a half. I'm watching. <laughs> what would your score be? Oh, my score's in the What do you think Drake could give you? <laughs> you can fuck with that nigga give me? I'm at, we asking you. I don't know. You I didn't know. try to think, you didn't try to all right, all right. Ice. What, what you think he'd give you nigga? Ice I said <laughs> What'd you think Drake would give Ish? It'd be less than one. Damn. Wow. Why? He likes all oh. his albums. <laughs> 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 I guess see what you did there, buddy. I see what you did. Nah, nah. That was pretty good, Ice. No. Because he no. gave him a one because he had a blue. I understood. Oh. All right. Uh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Slaps me. I'm watching how I laugh at this because that's really what Drake be saying to me too when he make all them little pump, <laughs> pump it up jokes and hey, you got the Airbnb rocking. He's Yo, really that- saying... Your existence is maybe a three. A two. Maybe a three. You made a little jam. You made, you made pump you made, it up. Yeah. Yeah. That's how a little joint over there. <laughs> pump it up is hotter now than it's ever been before. I want to see all the niggas that laughed at me for 20 years. Exactly. That's, that was my point. You're no, viral I, again, buddy. No, I'm paid. I'm not. <laughs> <I don't laughs> whatever the fuck TikTok you want. TikTok records pays up. I about what they talking about. <laughs> uh, Nike, TikTok, Kevin, I <laughs> talked out the wazoo for some shit I did when I was 21. I had to get back in the booth. Damn. 
This shit is working. That's fly. Yo, Niggas will give they, they gonna have an right leg to get one of those. Huh? You could ever own it out, right? Mm-hmm. So? 30 year mark. Mm. I'm, tw- I'm 20 far. in. Mm. Yeah, I'm 20 that's in. That's not nice. that far. Are you shitting? That's nice real estate. That's, that's nice. nice. That's when that's you get into that nice, nice real estate music game. Yeah. Like, that's some if wild you're shit. still somehow able to be mm-hmm. <laughs> relevant mm-hmm. in 30 years. That song? Even if you're not hot. Even if you're not hot. That record ain't going to go nowhere. Even if you're not hot. Even if you're not hot. Yeah, I'll sail off into the sunset and collect that. Helps to still be hot because they didn't have that in the game plan. Like yo, Phil. when they wrote, when they made that rule up, yeah, that was because like, you're supposed to be dead in 30 years, yeah. or at least like just forgotten Phil, about. Phil Collins, well, that's what I mean by that. Is just going, uh, yeah, what? they just killing them. What? Do you want to talk about the empire and the empire thing? I'm tired that's of y'all. Nasty, that's a, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, it's been this, I guess, uh, chart graph, whatever you want to call it, going around where people are trying to point out that quite a few artists that have signed to Empire have tragically lost their lives. And they're trying to say, oh, it's a conspiracy that Empire's got something to do with it. They got insurance on them because they know this is going to happen, et cetera, et cetera. Fam, stop. Y'all got to relax. Empire is what? The, the, the biggest, one of the biggest uh, distributors, distributors yes. out there? Yes. Hey, they're yeah. going to sign a lot of motherfucking people. Yeah. And it's independence. It's in. So a lot and, of these guys are independents. And a lot of. Reason why I have a problem with people pointing that out is it's a lot of dudes that have been or still active or whatever, still involved in the streets. Street dudes are dying. Not necessarily just rappers. We don't hear about them because they're not famous. They're not popular. They're not et cetera. So if you're a part of a certain life and they're, you're passing away, if you're not a rapper, we don't, we don't know. Just because you're assigned to Empire doesn't mean that Empire is putting money on your head or, or trying to orchestrate things behind the scenes to collect off of you. It's the lifestyle that a lot of people are living. It's not Empire. They just happen to be the, one of the biggest ones out there, so they're signing everybody. Like, grow up. That shit was disgusting. Yeah. It's nasty. That shit was disgusting. I, and I, you know what they're going to say did. now, though, is that you're signed to Empire. I'm signed there. Right? That's true. Hey. <laughs> I'm signed there right now. They hey got, guys, they got a check. <laughs> I'm playing. You have pushback. I was trying. You hear it? <laughs> I heard you. I see you cracking your neck. Go you ahead. hear it in my in my head. I don't know if I want to give it because I'm I'm with him, but I'm not with him. He's right, but again, I'm just thinking. It's not rappers that are signed to Empire. It's rappers, right? Mm -hmm. And for me, when I leave this pod, I go home and try to figure out why that is exactly, right? Like if Triple X is is not a rapper, I don't know that he is at that bike store with that much cash in that moment. If PNB is not a rapper, I don't know that that he's at that Roscoe's. If he's a carpenter. But hold on. If he's a carpenter or anything else, I don't know if his path puts him at that spot at that time it's it's our travels it's it's lifestyle because if he was a carpenter carpenter making that type of money and living that lifestyle you still would have that jewelry on you still would have it's the lifestyle this is is where i offer the pushback because when i go home i'm big with well why don't i ever see that carpenter I'm, this rapper is not the only field where... That's not true. I think I think what happens with... I was with you for a minute. I think what happens is... I'm going to keep going. And um, Actually, Simba just... Shout out to Simba. Simba just talked about this. And he was saying, like, yo, as a rapper, that's kind of your uniform. Most rappers would have to wear because you kind of got to present yourself as such mm-hmm. to be taken seriously. You know what I'm saying? And so as a carpenter... You could have a couple million dollars, but you don't necessarily have to show that. As a rapper, you got to have a watch. You got to have the chains. It's kind of uniform that comes along with being a dope street rapper is this is what we have to project. So the carpenter wouldn't necessarily have $300,000 worth of jewelry on in Roscoe's. He could be worth mad bread, but he don't have to show that. But now, see, what when I say lifestyle. Wait, wait, uh, hold up. I'm arguing some of this shit. Uniform to me means something you can take off. True. 
Mm-hmm. So I'm, I'm with you on what rappers have to do when they put on their costume. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He wasn't working. He wasn't at work, so he could. But are are you ever so, not? So, so wait, so wait, you so always wait, are so, working. So, so sure. wait, so wait, so wait, so wait. Well, yeah, well, if you don't have an off switch, or if you don't uh, take the costume off at any point, because mm-hmm. every rapper and and I want to focus on this. I hate to be serious now. Every rapper don't move like that, behave sure. like that, think like that. So that's just not the something that's, that comes with in, comes with rapper. Also, I, I'm not. I didn't also, put it on just rapper. Also, I'm getting into because even if y'all are right, and I submit to this, I'm getting into some of the psychology and the thinking that goes with the rapper that won't take it off. I don't know if the carpenter is out and he feel like balling and putting his jewelry on on a Friday night now that he's off work. I don't he know do that. if that guy. I don't. I think that guy might be more likely to take it off mm-hmm. or relinquish the shit than some rappers. That's new. That's See, that's new. Last part I came in here and talked about when a nigga got the drop on me, I politely took it off mm-hmm. and I handed it to him. And, I've, and listen, I've had these conversations with a few different people. Uh, this is an amalgam of thoughts. Mm-hmm. I've just been talking to the field. Mm-hmm. In speaking to the field, they reminded me that that's what was saluted. As if you took it off, you was a real nigga. <laughs> oh, they got me. Word here. He understands. He understands protocol. He understands how this goes. Today, those are it's not the, the teachings. Those it's are the, not the those. Today. Those are not the teachings that go on. It's the opposite right? today, bro. I, I, I also, let me continue. Well, let me continue. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Also. I want to stress the importance of I want to stress the importance of knowing the price to acquire something and knowing the price to maintain it which are two very different things. Mm. And in hip hop with all of this smoke and mirrors mm-hmm. bullshit, mm-hmm. we just be concerned about the price. When I was on one of them trips, they were showing me all these boats and the yachts and all of this shit. And I was like, God damn, what the fuck does that cost? Mm-hmm. And the dude riding with me was like, this is what it costs to park it. Right, right. This is what it costs <laughs> to do this. Insurance. This yeah. is yeah. what yeah. it costs. Drive yeah. for this. Yeah. And I was thinking, well, God damn. That mm-hmm. boat? That, that's a lot. That boat it's money different. And that private jet Helicopter. Money. Pro- yes. You can bring out private private jet cars. Maintenance on a car. That's you can true. go and get this. Yeah, so you why can go we get that? Like that? 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 Yeah, no, you get that, that Maserati. Yeah, you get the Maserati. But well, once you take that shit over there to the dealer, they're gonna crack your ass. So You're not my, prepared for that. So we got all of these rappers with mouthpieces and microphones, and we got all of these uh, media outlets, and just nobody is preaching. Yo, go get that shit insured. Man, we had we had Mano Jim and, and I know here. most Remember of y'all that? are not going to get that shit insured because most of it ain't insurable. All of that bust down, foggy shit that you bought from your man in the fucking street, you are gonna take that shit somewhere and they are gonna tell you the real the real worth of it. Yeah, and in your brain, and yeah. in your brain, you thinking it don't it don't matter because I could ju- I'll just go get another, get another one, one of uh-huh. this. But it do matter because what does that look like for the person on the other side? It don't it don't look like that. We don't preach enough about security. I'm so mad that all of these PMB clips are coming out because it's just giving you more insight and it's eerie. It's eerie. The clip, another clip came out about mm. him saying, I don't have security, but I have security. Mm. If you know what I mean. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, then you don't have. You don't have security. Well, then you don't have security. I went home last part, and all I could think about was stack bundles, right? Rest in peace, stack right. bundles, ching drugs, far rock. You already know what it is. Bino, fuck is up, squad up. Because my conversations with stack back last decade, early last decade, 02, 03 ish, 04 ish, mm-hmm. around the 05 ish. Sure, we were two tr- decades ago now. Two decades ago. Yeah. We old. Yeah, that's why I had to say if God yeah, yeah. But my conversations with him back then was, yo, get out of the hood. Yep. Yo, get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. And the struggle was niggas that got on 
We didn't want to leave where we was from. We wanted to show them it was possible. We wanted to be a beacon of hope and light and help the community and all that shit. And Stack Bundles got killed in Far Rockaway. God bless his soul. I hope his family and everybody's doing all right. I love that nigga. That was my man. Today, they're moving rappers from... The label is moving you out of your neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the culture shock that's involved in that now, there's culture shock there. Of course. You're moving me to a new place, new surroundings. I don't know this hood. I don't know that hood. I haven't popped yet. Let me paint the picture for y'all even clearer. That's true. I yeah, haven't yeah, popped that's, yet. That's important. Mm -hmm. So you're not putting me where you should be putting me. Right. you putting me close to mm -hmm. there mm -hmm. with a rent getting a little mm -hmm. 15, 25, whatever, 35, whatever 35. it mm -hmm. may be. And... And and now that and now that's what it is. The label is looking at it like that, but they're not looking at your safety. They're not looking at. So now you dead in the smack of some shit. Cause the label put me here. You thinking shit is peaches and cream, but shit ain't sweet. That's a problem. There's just mad little problems that come or with. Just, or just I feel uncomfortable being here. Mm -hmm. Your neighbors is looking at you like. You know what I'm saying? Like, I remember when I used to tell people, they'd be like, yo, where you live? And I used to be like, Edgewater. And they used to be like, oh, you're a rapper? <laughs> yeah, or, I remember Or you're a ball player? Those days. They right. used to, bro, people would ask you that. White people would be like, oh, you rap? Oh, you're, mm -hmm. you're in music? Right. No, nigga, I'm not in fucking music. S-D-E, bro. <laughs> no lie. Like, or they'll be like, oh, you, you know, they would ask you because they don't know that they're offending you. Right. Like, yo, you playing mm -hmm. a sport? No, I don't play a sport. So, they looking at you like, yo, oh, he don't really belong here. So now what you do? You get your money, you go back to your hood where you felt comfortable, mm -hmm. but now you fish food potentially. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So it's, it's a really, really. Or the rough, other side of that, thing. it ain't even that you go back. Like, you, people really believe like they hood fuck with them. Yeah, I know. Niggas really be thinking like, I'm, I'm safe here. You was safe till you got the bread. And that's the part they But it only really takes one person to not it fuck with you. One. Yeah. One person. And you ain't a shooter. Yeah. So when you from a certain hood, they know you're not a shooter. Mm -hmm. So I can rob this nigga with no repercussions. So you might fuck with these niggas and kiki with this nigga, but it's a nigga over here that's 47 that just came home mm -hmm. and he, don't, he know you ain't doing it like that. Yo, let me tell y'all out there that you get the security for when you didn't think you would need the security. Right. Bro, bro <laughs> she'll that, told, that is it. That's what you get it for. In the NWA movie, she'll told him, yo, you never know what you need till you need it. Mm -hmm. And that's the worst time to realize that's that you need it. Mm -hmm. I've seen niggas that there was potential smoke with in the most least right. likely places for me to see them. Airport, courthouse, church, walking, walking with your son somewhere. Like you can't control where you're going to see somebody at. Right. And if the security don't do nothing else, it'll give the nigga that got the drop on you just something else to think about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something else to plan. A possible deterrent. Something else to plan True. for. Possible hey, deterrent. Just a little bit. Hey, uh, hey maybe I won't time. try him right this second. I'll, I'll be I'll back. Catch him. I'll be back for mm -hmm. him. Something. True. See, a lot of times, a lot of dudes will think if I keep it on me, that'll be the deterrent. Oh, they know he keeps. Not when they got the drop on you. Right. I, I've been saying, I've, I said it on this pod before. Not when they got the when drop. You, when they got the drop on you, they got the you drop got, on you. You got. Fam, I got robbed. I'll never forget I got robbed. And a rapper made a joke about it, which I get it. He was responding. To, I used to troll a nigga. Okay, cool. Like he, somebody told him about something that happened a couple years ago and he made a joke. I'm laughing because I'm like, nigga, I'm still here. Yeah, I gave it up. The drop, what was I supposed to do? I remember I'm talking to one of the um, security guards at the spot where it happened at, like a couple weeks later or whatever. He was like, so what, you know, what happened? I told him. Dude, what, pulled out whatever, paused. Oh, nah, you ain't just reaching, try to grab it from him? Nigga, no, I'm not John Wick. <sighs> Fuck is you talking That's about? I was going to say something to what you said. Like, niggas is yo, crazy. back in the day, you said real niggas was like, yo, you take it off. But that, that hasn't always been the sentiment. And you can say that from our hood, Corey, that niggas would be like, no, nigga. And you got respect for doing that dumb shit. See, I, that, that was man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I said, I, remember, that's, we, that's, had, that's, we had Mano Jim and Surf sitting here. Remember you asked them about, you know, wearing all this jewelry. And sure, and, and if, you, if, you, if you lose it, and everybody jumped up, lose it how? Mm. Like, I, Oh, yeah, like, niggas did say that. Yeah, lose that's, it how? Fuck you mean lose it? They did say like, that. Like, they was ready to jump on us. You for even nah, asking the who, question. I, who and, asked that but wait, question? But wait, but wait, but wait. 
That's the problem. I agree. That that is exactly what I'm saying is the issue that we don't know is an issue because of things that we have been taught. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's wrong. <laughs> no, it's wrong. Right. Let me agree. let me right. finish. You're right. I think all of you, the rappers, because I realize there's a lot of people in rap that's not rappers. Mm. But that's the rappers, you niggas is rapper tough. Pan in. Zoom in. All of you niggas is rapper tough. That's not an insult. But the two words together is an oxymoron. The rapper part only allow you to be but so tough. You're a rapper. It's a you are a brand business likeness. Public servant. Public uh, entity. Public entity, entity. That is who you are. The people that are who some of y'all think y'all are, I don't believe y'all are even brave enough to sign up for that life. Y'all love your pictures too much. You love being seen, attention, traveling, parties, girls. I don't think some of y'all really know what come with the life that you niggas is talking about. I couldn't beg some of them niggas to get in a video, a camera. It was a video shoot. And niggas wouldn't get in the video. <laughs> Going to a, wait, road, where, huh? Checking the public bathroom before you, ch- y'all, it's, it's a life of paranoia that you got to commit to. You have to commit to that. And you niggas ain't that. My point is, there's, there are professional that out right. there. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. There's professional that. And now, I'm older, right? So now I'm learning some of the lingo. On Clubhouse, niggas is teaching me the lingo. Like the Chicago little gang member niggas out there is teaching me what merch mean. And, and there's a disconnect from wherever you at. In Houston slang, Atlanta slang, Chicago course, slang, yeah, New yeah, York yeah, slang, yeah. LA, LA slang. Mm-hmm. Whoa. That could get bad. We can't even understand each other. Right, right. All right, cool. You don't want to take it off, ish. But how'd you say that? How did you communicate it? What was the slang? Did I get it? How did I feel? If somebody is a professional that, I'm imagining their tolerance to be real low. Fuse is this big. Real low. Yeah. So there's just a lot to think about when it come to all this shit. And it's sickening for me because the teachings that come along with this shit that we so passionate about, they teaching us wrong. They are. They are. Yeah. They teaching us wrong. If at all. Yeah. I'm about to say not even it's not even being taught. It's not that they teaching us wrong. Or it's by design. Or it's by design. They teaching it. Or it's by design. They teaching it. Nah, they teach, or it's by they design. It? Yeah. Because little kids and little kids look up to just them niggas. Like I don't even care. I don't even think it's a demo thing. Like it, now what attracts the the admiration may be different. Like if you go to white culture. They admire certain shit. If you come to black culture, we admire certain shit. That might be different. But again, whoever you looking at, you admiring how they carry themselves. You admiring the shit that they say. You admiring the message that they convey. Jim was on a, the, the pod and he said, yo, we have to stop saying the game is to be sold, not told. That mm-hmm. shit has been in our community for absolutely mm-hmm. since pimps was out in the 60s and 70s. They've mm-hmm. been saying that, right? Mm-hmm. So that's something that niggas grow up hearing that message and they convey it because I was, I, the that niggas was, that, that you looked up to have been saying it for 30 mm-hmm. years. Yo, that's why that's I, a wrong message that's been conveyed. That's why I say I'm I'm on record saying that 50 Cent is probably one of my greatest hip hop stories to witness because he had to ascend with really them dudes yeah. after him. Really? Yeah, like. And not, with him. Not the yeah, with him too. And with him too. But not the play play rap version mm-hmm. of that. No, the real ones. Yeah. The real version of that. The ones he, who the rappers be pretending to be. He can't look at Bushes the same. Yeah. <laughs> right. I think I I've, I've said that here. Think about that. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. a professional somebody mm-hmm. in there. That's the professional that poked your tie and waited for you to pull over. That's mm-hmm. the that is a professional niggas that do that. There was a clip uh, a year ago, a half a long ago, in Brooklyn of the dude in a constru- construction worker uh, outfit in the morning, acting like he was doing construction. Yeah, yeah. I remember this. Lit a nigga up. That is a professional. Mm-hmm. 
You niggas are rapping. No, they sat on you. They knew your route. Mm -hmm. They knew how you dropped your kid off at school. Mm -hmm. They knew what corner you turned. So we're going to set up these orange cones right here right. and a little fucking sign. And we're going to sit here with the bright vest on. You're going to stop right here because you come here every single morning. And we sat on you for two months and know your route. And you're going to pull up and they're going to DMX you. Remember DMX killed the nigga in, um, in Belly? Yeah. He had the fucking click, dreads, the dread wig with the fucking squeegee, squeegee and, mm -hmm. and knew the nigga stops there every morning and tore his ass up. That ain't what the average rapper is living. That's I true. Got, I just got to pause you. I just want awareness to be as high as it can possibly nah, that's be. True. No, no. Yeah, that, yes. That's my, yes. I'm not, yes. I'm not, I don't, I hope I'm not offending anyone by spreading this message. I just want awareness to be all the way up. I want your uh, intuitiveness intuitiveness right like outside of you niggas rap lyrics like i'm talking about when you're able to drive straight and recognize the town change mm -hmm. i'm talking about when awareness it, that stuff yeah that stuff when a certain song come on and you realize oh it might be time to go yeah let me just make the back and blood joke no dog when, when you see them like niggas you in hear that shit come on when you see like, them niggas in the corner talking Mm -hmm. And only one of them keep looking at you. Mm -hmm. Yes, it, you people can't even recognize when they get in that word. They don't know. I know. They don't and, know. And I know that there's no way to know sometimes when it's your day, it's your day. That's not true. There's a way to you know just, when you really live that life and when you really, dog, it's just a different teaching. I just think if you really, you don't even have to necessarily live that life. You've been, had a couple, you just been through some shit. Lived the I don't mean like you born oh, yeah, 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 yeah. like okay, your okay. your experiences yeah. Yeah, experience teach you something. certain shit. Yes, a lot of niggas didn't. Experience Bro, it's the, at night if I'm driving, like I know I don't pull up too close to the car in front of Never. me at the light. Ever, I'm always giving myself an escape. Never. You, want, you want me to tell just you no that? matter what I'm well, playing the mirrors. If something even well, yeah. look off, oh yeah, I'm out. That's a good uh, good manual to to draw out right now. To, to, in case people don't know, yeah, no, one of my you should never be up on nobody's bumper. Never, never. One, one of my give yourself room to move around if you have to. My man told And prepare me. for it. Always back in the parking spot always. if you can. If y'all know, I'm always Give yourself back. time mm -hmm. to drive off. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you the weirdo nigga I am. Some nights before I go out, I walk on the balcony and just smell the air. <laughs> just see how, see what it. Yo. I, I don't feel right tonight. I was going to say, you know, the funny shit no. is that's not weirdo shit. People have had gut feel it in the air. Instinct, whatever. Tonight ain't the night. don't tonight. feel right tonight. Man, my man told and it'd be me that one shit. night that you ignore it that the shit happens. It fucked me up. But he 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 play. The nigga said he never rides in the right hand lane. And I ain't get it. Like on a two way highway, he's never on the right hand side. Because that's the driver's side. And me and you at fucking heavens. That nigga came up to us this close to the door. You couldn't have got out. I know. I wish he was driving. <laughs> I never thought of that But my man told me that He said yo When he be driving Like if you on A two lane highway right. He never ever ever Be on the right hand side He always play the left Cause now you gotta come down The other side to get me right. And I'ma see that Fam I do shit Like especially at wow. night I start I just pay attention Oh that car made the same Last three, three times. turns That yeah, I made that's that's Now I'll start doing Some bullshit Like all right, let me Bust this you over here mm -hmm. Oh if you do uh, You just yeah, start paying You, yeah, you right, just right. start paying attention Turn left. Be left, completely left. Ob like other people. You'll be driving completely oblivious that you're being followed. Mm -hmm. Like yo, that car. To All right. All that right, word. That word on. comes up a lot for me too as I've been rethinking the, the P and B thing. Oblivious. Oblivious. I think I I assume that he wasn't really aware of where he was. Huh. I've been seeing some shit like I saw. And I assume. I don't assume, but it's possible. That they didn't know who he was. It's possible. I would assume mm -hmm. that. it's possible. Yeah. He just Very was possible. a shiny nigga and he was in there. Yeah. But that's the part that makes me even more sick to my stomach when I think, damn, they might have let him live if they knew who he was. Maybe. 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 Of, of course we just. No, no, no. Maybe. But maybe. Uh, maybe, yo. Niggas don't want that type of heat on them. They don't. Now, nobody's True. looking for that type of heat. True. Some niggas don't care. But, yeah, of course. But no, you could have robbed a nigga without but that. You get what I'm saying? You could have robbed them without that. And some people don't care, but some people would have been like, look, if I if I if I kill him, 
Now they're going to put some time, some dollars, and some resources mm -hmm. into finding me. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. a another nigga getting robbed in the middle of the hood. They're not going to care too You much. just got caught slipping. Yeah. But when, when, when people start killing the right people, God, this sounds horrible, but the resources get put into finding the killer. Yeah, absolutely. If That's you kill a nobody, not that nobody's nobody. We know what I, I mean. Know. I know right, exactly right, what you dog, mean. That shit gets swept under the rug. But when you do some shit to a public figure, you do some shit to the wrong person, yeah. you get found. You Years see ago. how quick, uh, rest in peace, Mac Miller. Any of that. Immediately. They'll find you. Yeah. They'll find you. That's just from a, a, He's been, a drug overdose. And that's just an overdose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The dude that overdosed from- um, I call him like, poisonings. Like I don't did. like Poison, Mike, yeah, right. Mike Williams. Mike Williams Yeah, yeah. they did yeah. that too. Yeah. I was shocked. Actually, I was shocked. But the, the white dude that would play it in um, Tom Cruise movie, um, that OD, they found him like it's quick. Found him mm. quick. Like that shit is different. When you, uh, a regular person in the street, ODs that didn't have no money, yeah. they just ain't another, even gonna put a body. dollar in the finder who sold them that other body. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, they, I agree with you. They might have let him live had they known who it was. Maybe. Possibly. Possibly. I mean, and there's millions of just questions what that you just, yeah, what is. Yeah, and again, rest in peace to PMB Rock. Absolutely. Prayers to his family. We, we just have to unlearn Prayers the shit that her. we've learned. Prayers for her. I sure. cannot. I still, I'm sure. not over it if I'm sure. her. Sure. What? No, no over. Never. Never. I'm just saying, imagine, I'm Never. thinking about her. Never. She's been in my heart. Yeah. yeah. She's been Never. in my heart. Ever we got to unlearn some of the messages and shit that we've been taught are cool. And it starts from the old niggas that the kids are looking up to. Yep. You got to kind of start telling these niggas it's not cool. That shit ain't cool, fam. This not cool, fam. This not cool, fam. Coming home to your kids every day is cool. Mm -hmm. Going to ballet is cool. Getting old is going cool. To, going to soccer practice is cool. Just getting old. Like, that's cool. You get what I'm saying? Like, your, your son teaching him to keep the uh -huh. gooseneck follow through on his foul shots. That's cool. That other shit ain't cool, dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but we had this talk. Uh, we had this talk before. You right. And I'm going to say you right because I'm an old nigga with you. But the young niggas is killing the old niggas. They're killing us. No, that's true. Because they a lot don't of these have a old, value of life, period. Now, they, a lot of these old niggas yeah. is not respecting the young niggas. That's one. That's, that, they that's really perfect. not trying to put them on. They trying to sun them and they trying to strong arm them and they trying to do other shit. I'm talking about the nigga. Because some of the old niggas, just because you was an old nigga, that don't mean you was respect worthy. I'm talking about the respect worthy old niggas. It was the old niggas in our hood. Niggas ain't respect them. Ish, what I'm going to go say to the young nigga that got 20 bodies on. If he respects you? Yeah. You, they'll listen. Yo, it's another way. You can get money doing it's another way. How do you get that person to respect you? Your rep. I don't have one that he would he respect. Ain't gonna respect he ain't going to respect you then. Or, you, you can't tell or me not, not only that. No, that's what I said. You, he respects you. You might have a rep to where, because we've, we've had an instance in hip hop where a younger dude and an OG, highly respected, clashed. I'm not saying any names. And like you said, I don't want to hear that shit you talking. I don't care. A lot of I've seen younger artists say shit like, "Oh man, that old Fifty used to say, fuck you, OG niggas. Y'all stuck in the '80s." Like it was, it's a disconnect. Like, fam, I don't look up to you. Fifty could say it. I know he could, but I'm he just could, saying, but but but, I, that, but, but I even adapt to that mentality. Thinking, and because I know but, some people are like, "Why can't he say that?" No, nah, <laughs> I even still think though the right nigga can have a conversation with Fifty Cent. I never met 50 Cent in my life. Maybe now. He I'm seemed, at that moment. Even back then, he seemed to be a logical nigga. If you, it's how your approach is, yo. Mm -hmm. That's it's how your approach that's is. True. Like certain like niggas, I know who you are. We not beefing, but I know who you are. Yeah, yo, let me holler at you. 50 Cent is fucking boo from Queens, whatever part of Queens that is Bayside, Guy Brew Web. But when I, when I got back to Queens, everybody knew about boo from Queens. I, I don't know. 50 is that. So... I believe it. I don't know. I don't. I don't know about that. I don't know if the older niggas could have ran up on, on fifty to tell him anything back then. <laughs> and that's what. And I'm that's kind of what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. There's there's niggas today. I don't know that feel that the same niggas, way. But I don't. But you're right. You like say. the niggas that respected him, Jam uh, that he respected, Jam Master J or whoever. Yes, that's that. Right. But but then that's the topic. Then how do we go about gain, gaining respect in hip hop? That's not that way. That's I think it that. needs to be it's like not a, that respect. It, it needs to be like a, a. Let me give you an a, example. A, a partnership. Almost. What, like, what do you think happens? And we're gonna take a, a situation that's happening currently. What do you think happens with Freddie Gibbs and and, and and Benny if Jay calls them? 
if certain niggas that's respected on the street side as well as the business and music side or just respected as a black man that came from where y'all from Mm -hmm. and it's a bigger vision. When you hear 21 Savage talk about Jay-Z and 21 Savage is a street nigga from what I've heard, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. he talks about Jay-Z with a different level of admiration. Sure. You get what I'm saying? Boy, he's not a street nigga. Always, I said from what I've heard. I'm just trying to. I, I, I don't yeah, want no, to use I pod lyrics. No, yeah, no, doubt. True, 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 true. no, no, from what I've heard. But you get what I'm saying, like. Right. So when when certain people um, approach you, dog, even in the streets, it's certain niggas that stamped. Mm-hmm. It's certain mafia niggas that was stamped. So certain niggas listened to this nigga. Because he was stamped already and he stood for something and he was a solid nigga. Mm. So even if I don't agree with him, I at least hear him out without being disrespectful. I think that certain shit I told you on the pod, call Freddie, you got a rapport with him. Call Benny, y'all got a rapport with I've him. I've told both of them that they face a stop. You get what I'm saying? Not that I'm anyone that anybody will listen to. I'm just saying, but no, no. They might right, though. That you're right. You made an effort. And you could be one of many. You made an you know effort. What I'm saying? But certain niggas, I think would the, the message comes differently. You get what I'm saying? When, when niggas used to beef, they would go get Farrakhan because Farrakhan is fucking Farrakhan. Uh-huh. I don't care what you're talking about. Farrakhan is Farrakhan. Right. Jim we, Jones, we have a date for Riz Islam, by the way. Jim, Jim Jones had a story about Farrakhan. Mm. And he said, yo, <laughs> he was like, dog. He was being a little unruly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And he said, them niggas pulled up on him like, yo, yo, yo. And he said, yo, that's Farrakhan, fam. You fall in line when certain <laughs> niggas come. <laughs> right. Yeah, you fucking right. That's my point. So again, certain people could mend it. I think they just be off doing their own shit and they don't step in. Or they it's unbeknownst to them, possibly. You know Maybe. what I'm saying? They too busy for to even catch wind of it. But I think certain niggas in the hood, you listen to a respected nigga. In our hood, we, we did. All right. So that's what that's what I got for you. And rest in peace, Jesse Powell. Oh, yeah, no doubt. Hold up, man. Yeah, some of y'all don't know. Oh, get, get, so, nah, get some, of, some of y'all don't know. Yeah, this was outside man, for that. Man. I know he know what to do. <laughs> How many weddings y'all heard that at? Mad wedding. <laughs> nah, this was the one. Nah, that, that was. was uh, still no word on how he passed. Just that he passed peacefully at home. How old? Fifty-one. Hmm. Mm. That's right. If you're old enough, you dedicated this to somebody out there. And you're not with them now. Hey, Alex. You. Hey. Yeah, let that rock for King for King Jesse out there. I'm gonna make a change in my life. Come on, you heard them harms, Parks. I still got it. I still got it, dog. <laughs> it's about to get in full karaoke mode. Go ahead and get your shit off, yo. Yo, you got to hear what he's saying in this shit, nigga. I've most heard this song most men ain't really willing to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, most men. Nah. Uh-oh. Come on, come on audience. Come on, Let me hear that. Oh, you about to sing? You got, sing you with you me? Like, on, poor <laughs> like poor Mons? Baby, it's you the way you... The way you... The way you say my name the... Now this is that shit What? This shit still go No, it still go What? I see how this song worked <laughs> I just want to be yours From this day forward now niggas talking about bending her over the island, yo. That's what I'm talking. They we don't get this no more. And she talking about nigga. She wants you to bend over the island. Yo, I am so sick of these R&B niggas. I'm, I, these, this, yeah. this, this, this new crop R&B you ain't niggas. Find that no more. Man. She don't want to hear that. You might be right. I disagree, <laughs> but I disagree with that too. Okay. I disagree. I, I disagree. totally disagree with that too. The more layers you peel back of the onion, mm-hmm. that's true. This is there. That, they want that. This is there. It That's exists. True. It's, it, it may not exist. Maybe she on might surface not level. Okay. She might. Yeah. Women have their humans, but Human women too have they have fence their all the way defense up. walls yes. mechanisms guard the uh, what they show their protective gear. Yeah. Yeah. Barbed wire yeah. on the gate. But, uh, all yeah. That but underneath all of that, cut. <laughs> <laughs> the toughest. Word. The toughest of broads. Mm-hmm. Want to melt like a little cookie in, in your, your arms. <laughs> They yeah. do. Come on, Alex. You know what I'm saying? That's that four-hour hey, four hey, Floyd the, Mayweather the, conversation. The toughest of women. 
That's just want to be able to lay their head on your chest <laughs> and unwind. You were I'm telling you, yo. Hey, she don't stand a chance? Uh, never. <laughs> All right, let me turn this off. It, it think we're not a pod no more. Nah, He's ready to do a concert. <laughs> nah. My parents are surprised that Di- Diana Ross uh, retirement concert tickets are so much. What? <laughs> concert That's tickets. the end of the sentence. Concert tickets in general are up if you can get them. <laughs> My mom but, but is crazy. Why yeah. would you think that that wouldn't be hot? Duh, y'all knew about it before me. <laughs> yeah. Right. So when the why last, y'all sleeping? I'm not. When the last time they bought a ticket? Huh? It's probably been a while. No, my mom, my mom go, you buy go, bought a ticket. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ticket. you buy them. Yeah, but they still inquire about the price. Joey, of a get me these. I, yo. They'll inquire about the price. And if, if it's up, I just buy it. But my mom got a good price. A good price. They told her, yo, wait, because it's hot right now. They all the way up, but wait closer to the date and we'll get you a good price. They wait to the date, get it a good price. She said, oh, no, it's too much. I said, Mom, so you just had that man work for however many months or weeks but, uh-huh. searching. And you think that that's too much? Why she don't got her own Amex? She do. Ooh. But she's considerate. The pre-sale. She's considerate of me. I know. I know what them cabinets call. <laughs> no, her house is late. No, I, I, I went there. No, I went there last no, week. No, her house. That shit is ridiculous. You know, I went. She, but she went nah. crazy. I had to go nah. over there and do the Q and A. Don't she go. She called me to come put a. Don't smart go over there. Don't help my mom to pocket watch me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Alex, you see the boy? That's Bro, not. That's, right that's not what that's, that's hilarious. hilarious. That I know it's nuts. not. Yeah, that's, no, that's nice. No, nigga. She's like, Yo, I need a smart. Wait, she's moved out now though. No, no, you shitting me. <laughs> but we're we're closely coming nah, it's, coming it's, to it's our end. How do you feel about that? Uh, good and bad, bittersweet. Good and bad. Yeah. Like I don't even remember what it's like living by myself. Mm. No, no more. Like it's been uh, damn yeah. near a year. Yeah. So yeah. it's like this is this is life. This is it to yeah. go back to just being alone? Bored as hell. Dope moms upstairs. Yeah. Right. Just yell up there real quick. It was dope. But I'm happy for her. Crib looks beautiful. Go mom. Sure. 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 Go mom. That shit look good. Um, That's funny. Yeah, I just had something to say before you asked me that shit. I don't remember that. My bad. I was over there like, wait, you got a chandelier in the bathroom? No, <laughs> nigga. I'm, Yo. I'm going like, oh, we took the blue tape. Like, so that's what I do on my jobs. I give my client some a roll of blue tape. Mm. So anything that you see, put some tape on it. Like yeah. some shit I might have missed. Uh-huh. So I go in there. I say, Yo, this is what I do. We found a roll of blue tape that the contractor left. So we just going around, going around. Oh. I'm in the bathroom. And my nigga, when I was in the bathroom, I went to put some tape somewhere, and the toilet had a conversation with me. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck? Nah. I'm like, yo, what? what? I'm stupid ass smart toilet. <laughs> I said, yo, yeah. I want one. That shit genius. I, I want said, whoa, 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 whoa. How much this cost? Thousand? She like, oh no, you got the wrong toilet. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Yo. Okay. That was slick, that little question you asked me about why she ain't got her own Amex. I don't know. She watches too. I'm shooting it back. I'm shooting it back to you three gentlemen. <laughs> your girl got your Amex I don't have my Amex nigga <laughs> what the fuck is you talking about <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with him <laughs> she got one that's not what I asked you yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. no she yeah. She has one, but not yeah. yours. Yeah. No, no, his. Oh, That's what he says. He tried to slick it out. Like, <laughs> your turn. He tried to slick it out. No, no, she doesn't. She could though. She wanted one. Do you have Amex? No. Oh, okay. but she could have. She could have one of my credit cards if she wants. Your turn. What? Nigga, you crazy as <laughs> hell. No, I'm not crazy. I'm asking oh, you to no. answer the question. No, but she can have mine whenever she wants. So she got one. <laughs> Not the same. <laughs> it's a little, it's a little Not different. Not the same. Yeah. <laughs> she can have mine when she feel like it, but with a little speech. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now. Right. I hey, mean, what's the hey, same thing? Hey, you keep it light. No, a, no, it's no, not. no, no, that's it, not the same it, thing. It no, it's the not. Same. Hey, you can't laugh at his lock screen no more either. Why? Wow. <laughs> nah, yeah, that's a fact. That's <laughs> over. Yeah, that's yeah, over. Yeah, that the floor is yours. The floor is mine. She got your Amex. Is the floor mine? Yes. Yeah. Please give it to you. Sure. Give him the floor. No. Okay. He think Wait, you got a muscle. I, 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 my man. I got a man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my man. It's my man. Y'all are paid to talk. Yeah, we can talk about some other shit. All right, so time, the music. Time matters. <laughs> time matters. Oh, I'll say. That. Okay. Time matters. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. Oh, yeah. That's what you were saying. Yeah. Oh, no, no, it don't matter. But not for no lock screen. But for Amex, it does. Yeah, for Amex, yeah. Yeah. Time matters. I mean, yeah, I mean, you ever check? You ever check the uh, shit and see that <laughs> she was wilding that month or something like that? 
I got the speech. I, you saying, yo, I'll give her the card with a speech. Yeah. She got her own card, same speech. <laughs> speech matters, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I speak, we speak, we speak, we speak it, nigga. Oh, my girl with speech a car. I don't yeah. know Portuguese, but I know I got speech, <laughs> nigga. What you talking about? It's important to know your partner, too. That is yeah, true. true. Yeah, for sure. Oh, that is true. Yeah. <laughs> should, should my girl have her own? Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you, you be looking at the bill like, whoa, whoa what? what? Nigga. No. Yeah, I look at no bill. I look at all them little shopping pages she follow. No, I'm saying when the bill came. Instagram. Oh, man. And them <laughs> niggas hit my date. I got to set up the notifications. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. You stalking bing, her purchases? Bing, bing. That's that. Yeah, that might be nah, a little stalking. Yeah. For my own too. So, yeah. I know, I know. Yeah, yeah but why you gotta know, know? Why you gotta know every time? I got she's notifications swipe. on for when I buy something. Yeah, <laughs> I do. That. I do. Yeah, we let him say anything. Here. I do. But wait, I, I, I do that too though. Yeah. Every time, every time I. It, it notifies me. Yeah. Anytime yeah, some online, anything, the automatic payments, many, anything. Yeah. Anytime something I posts really, off one of our accounts. Suck ass nigga, yo. Shut up, yo. <laughs> Anytime something posts off one of my accounts, it notify me. <laughs> something wrong with this guy, yo. All right, what else is what else is important? Ish has a list full of funny <laughs> yo, shit. Yo, word. Uh, <laughs> Parks has a few funny things, too, but Parks shit be like, enough damn phone out. Nah, it's got, the, it's got some funny shit. <laughs> well, music. We, we could always we do get music. music. Yeah, we could do that. I don't think we really touched that. ESTG came out. That's who I played at the intro. That, the I'm intro of this about. pod. Every time ESTT drops, it's like 19 songs. It's 21 on this one. Even better. This guy does not stop working. And he don't feel nothing. Huh? Yeah, yeah. he don't feel nothing. Yeah. And he'll, and he'll shoot him himself. <laughs> that, <laughs> and, 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 if they, and if they don't succeed, no, he'll spin again. That's, wait, no. No, he tells you. No, no, no. no he he told me, you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's not me. That no, no, I'm not said, saying that. That nigga said love is evil spelled backwards. Man. Uh, everybody said that. <laughs> everybody said that. Yeah. But when track one is called Have Mercy... And then track two is called love, love. I'll Shoot Him Myself. Eminem. Eminem, Kendrick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody's uh, done, played uh, that. Lux. That's what I said, Lux. <laughs> Loaded Lux. Lux did it the best to be paused. Don't listen to none of them. Unpause it, though. <laughs> no, 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 sir. <laughs> if you think Lux did doing the best, then if that's your shit. No, I'm going to leave it paused. That's your shit. <laughs> what, what you said earlier? Uh, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> you take, Give me an example. You want to take six? <laughs> What did you say about taking six? You said something about taking six. six. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, the six inches will do. That's what you said. (laughs) And then you said pause, but if that's your shit. No, 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 pause. (laughs) It's not my shit. Six inches will do it. No, 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 it's not my shit. Unpause it. No, no, leave that pause. (laughs) Oh, y'all are sick. See, this is why. See? What happened? I'm going to try to vaguely give y'all this. And this is my back to my earlier point about music and what we're teaching and what we're doing. School is back in. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. These kids are threatening to shoot the school up. And, and then be very clear. It's, it's no, no, no. It's September. That means school just started. Right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they ain't been there but a month. Shit, if that long. A month. Yeah. It's been okay. Months. Labor Day was two weeks, weeks ago. Yeah. You know what I mean? But in some of the other parts. Oh of the yeah, country, yeah, 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 yeah. A month. Still, it's September all around the country. Already, y'all got. Like, we think the kids ain't looking and, and listening and learning and peeping and learning what they could apply. Yo, when I was a kid, I knew how to get a, the fake fire drill. But see, I don't even... I knew how to send in a bomb threat to the school, and, but it wasn't, like, for real. Today, no, you got to no, honor no, that no, no, threat. No, 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 I was just about to say, it's different. You got to yeah. honor that threat. Because, see, but see, today, they look at it also where, where society, we fuck up. These kids look like, you know, you get some coverage if you shoot the school up. Sickness. Yeah, so it's like... And you're out. <laughs> but no, like, you get it every time there's a... Sh- like, the name is said. They picture is on the news. Like, it's... it's. I'm going out and infamy, yeah, damn near. But, but they doing at, that. Well, going out, I don't think some of them picture them going out. Well, I... I don't, I don't want to say going out. They don't. They don't... Well, some do. They don't play the movie. Some do. Though. No, some yeah, do. No, some quite, do. Actually, quite some a few do. do. Yeah. Some do. See, but look how fast, if you just imagine, look how fast you get to that standoff uh, when... Uh, you know, what's the school that they moved that's not there no more when the cops wouldn't go in? You vowed it. But look how fast you get that standoff. The kids say, I'm going to go shoot up the school. Mm-hmm. Uh, you send out mass alerts to all the parents. If you're a parent, what you about to do? Take off work. you going up to that school mm-hmm. to mm-hmm. get your kid out that school, right? 100%. Yeah. If you're the school, what's supposed to happen? You lock the school down. to lock it down. Can't no kid move. Mm-hmm. Now we got an issue. <laughs> not if you're a parent. 
Yeah. Oh, my kid's moving. Yeah, I don't know what the issue is. If, if, if I'm coming in that school. You'll lock the school down for strangers. No. No. No, no. When, when they do a lockdown no, like it's that, a lockdown. no, it's a lockdown. Yeah. Are you shitting me? Prison, really? Yeah. Yes, Joe Clark. No kid, can Joe Clark. Move. Lean on me. Nobody's Check. moving. Locked. That's what a lockdown. How are you going to tell me that if I'm a parent? I'm yeah, I'm, I'm not trying to hear that. I they told the parents that. that. Yeah, but they listen. The niggas hop gates. No, they didn't. The no, niggas some, in Uval they hop did. gates. Yeah, some they went and got their kids. Some listen. That would be a standoff. It, it, and it, I didn't mean to make you sad. No, I'm just, I don't see it. it just, it's not a standoff. I don't know no standoff. I mean, again, some upper yeah. car. I think I drive, yeah, car, I drive that car right now. So what else drive? ESTG? ES. Simba, friend of the show, Simba. Simba yes, drive. Oh, yes, sir. Wait a second. Simba and drama. Wait a second. Ish, I went out with Simba again. Simba, album out right now, Simba and drama. I went out with Simba again. <laughs> Your man. He's my man now. Your ba- and he admits it too. This man. is admitted from both of you. I like Ish a lot. You like him a lot. My man. Y'all, we went to the strip club. You niggas huddled up over all of that bullshit y'all was talking. <laughs> nigga stupid. And not even two days later. He went back differently. He came out with just me. <laughs> <laughs> How it go? A little different? I want to hear it. Let that. me show you. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> I already know how it Oh, uh, come on, all, all I ever do is take photos of things. Uh, I'll get it to you off mic. Come on, But he went and got some singles. Uh, uh-huh. He went and got some singles. He was on the back wall with me, dancers, strippers, tapping me. Y'all feel you now. Actually, where my you, phone at? You lying. <laughs> <laughs> you are lying. Actually, because I don't want you to take Joe's word, because nobody out there believes me since I f- <laughs> Let me call these niggas. Oh, Hold up. I got a trick for y'all. Damn, Damn, it's what you go. You got. You got it. Come on, young you gotta, king. You gotta make them. Nah, young king. But that's back that. to my point. To ish, the right one to get it out of you. You could have all your little beliefs. <laughs> your beliefs. Your, all your little beliefs. <laughs> Let's see if Simba will pick not, up on not, album release day. Not the Bay Area. If guy. album release day, he probably really fuck with us, and he fucks with Ish, so he might pick up. Nah, album. Yeah, release. Ish, you call him. It is album release. Well, yesterday yeah. it was album release. Yeah. Well, it is album release. I'm album release, release day. For him, right now. Yeah, no, nah, don't don't not answer now, dog. That's the Bay Area guy. He, yeah, he, I know. He ain't don't know. He ain't I'm just it. telling you. You ain't, you ain't trying to hear that issue. Your, your nah, man. Uh oh. Hey, may I speak to Simba? This is Joe Budden from the Joe Budden podcast. Uh, with my nigga EST Ice. <laughs> <laughs> EST Ice. Why yes, you running at the strip club with it? Oh, oh man, man. my baby. Well, man. well, which which time, Simba? Uh oh. Because that's well, what I'm. The last time. The last that, time. Well, Ish wasn't there the last time. That's what I was just Ish, telling him about. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ish, Ish didn't come out. Ish, Ish, I went against the code. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't help it. I oh, couldn't help it. Oh, come it on, on young no guy. More. It started clapping. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, hey, hey, Simba, oh, I was just telling man. Ish that you were a different person the next time we went to the strip club and he didn't believe me. I told uh, him you went and got some I, singles. I'm, I'm trying to shoot my God some bell. Yeah, I, tur- I turned to a whole new man, Ish. I can't even lie, <laughs> oh, man. The, man. The, the Joseph Trick Daddy dollars has rubbed <laughs> off on me. I can't do nothing about it. Oh. I was a trick the other night and I felt great. Hey, hey, round of applause, man. Give him hey, some round applause. of applause. Come Hold on, up, man. Nah, they don't go hey, out. <laughs> Them niggas in a bay gonna take your card away. Yo, what the fuck? Now listen, trick ja- trick daddy dollars might have been in effect, but for you, it was a lot of torso over the bar action. Again? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Again? Whole torso when the I was trying to see what was I, in I the actually, rails. Hey. I actually uh like one of those females that was in Starlet. She's a good friend of mine. She likes <laughs> oh, hey, hey, sure. she likes you too. Yeah, we like each other. Yeah, Yo, your torso you, you your your torso was in there like a Lego. <laughs> <laughs> I, I couldn't I, help it. Yeah, yeah you were trying to see if they had the sugar the most free Red Bull. Women in New York City. Oh, yeah, nah, man. this nigga was in, his body was looking like a Tetris piece. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was. I, I definitely was hunched over like an eighty year old. <laughs> oh man, she got you. Man. Hey, no, she hey, got you. Hey, no, you did the right thing. You did mm-hmm. the right thing. Hey, fam, my man definitely, here trying to shoot my man some bell. Hey, 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 Simba, when you come back out, we'll take Ish out and show him the new you. <laughs> 
the, the new you. I might go back to the old me by then. Oh, please. Nigga, please. Yo, <laughs> yo, I can't go might back. go back to the old me by then. Ain't because no going it back. keeps me on point, and I think that's why I lost my mind because it wasn't there. You got swayed. You, in my you head, got swayed. I was inspired. Swayed. I was inspired by I the way you said it. I was throwing money. You led by he, example. Yeah, yeah, nah, he just said it. Start clapping. I was inspired. Joe got this. Joe got this shit figured out to where when he throws the money in the air, it falls a certain way. But mine wasn't falling that way. <laughs> I was trying to figure it out. Oh, man. Yo, when you come back out here, hit us, man. We back at it. Congrats. Yeah, I love hey, congrats man. on that album, man. Man. So I appreciate y'all forever. Ice, man, come on. EST dropped today, man. I dropped today. Hey. Come on, EST Ice. Come on, man. We outside. What's up? No, we outside, man. We outside. Uh, Wait, you're still here? No, 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 I'm in oh. Minneapolis. Oh, I'm about tour. to say. All right, man. Good luck out there. Have fun. Be safe. Be, be safe. safe out there, boy. I appreciate y'all, man. Love y'all. Love. Love. Peace. I love that guy, man. Yeah, that that guy's a good guy. guy. This tape is dope, man. I, I haven't heard his project yet. But yeah, Andy went absolutely I crazy like on all the flex. freestyles. Yeah, yeah, I like what he did at uh, he Sway. Did, he yes. went every of them. Every, all, all of them. Yeah. He every went out, the flex one, all of them. He went out. But he told me an issue that he was strapped for, for war up he here. Yeah. He, he he said he's he not had, playing. He ain't playing. He came up here to do that and get the fuck out and go on tour. Shout out to Joyner Lucas. Uh, okay, that's, that's what you're with? Yeah, that's, that's what tour he's on. So, okay. yeah, shout out to Simba. No. Um, like, look, even talking to him. Dog, that young nigga was receptive to all the shit we were saying. Remember? Mm -hmm. Like, literally, he had his own mind. Like, right, don't right. be clear. He And he stand firm and when he stand in, but right. he was open like, yo, what, what, what you, hold up, what you mean? No doubt. Oh, shit. Yo, that meant, yo. Yo, that's a, that's like, a, dog, you a gotta, strength. Yeah, like, yo. That to be able to dope. understand that, yo, I don't know it all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So some, some niggas, respect. Some niggas that I, yeah, that I respect giving me some game, I have to be willing to take to, to accept that That's true He ran around there. He was with us I seen him with Jim and No them. I seen him every <laughs> he, um, Every time I scroll, this nigga That's the, it out here It takes energy To be a rapper yo No it does It takes energy To be a rapper And they want you To go do that shit Like the mm -hmm. label mm -hmm. Or whoever's with you Now go go run around Take pictures mm -hmm. Shoulder make friends. rub Shoulder rub Yeah, yeah. Smart Now Smart. Music lovers Yes sir <laughs> R&B lovers Oh My bad <laughs> Rock out You said music my nigga but real music. No, this is a, this no. is an R and B week for me. Huh? I, I bought two R and B albums this week. Okay. Yeah. Dick Dixon and Jesse Reyes. Jesse Reyes. That album's really good. It's really good. That album is real. Well, I can't even make my jokes about Parks because it is is a really good album. It's a good album. But I know some other reasons Parks might think it's a really good album. I don't care what he says. <laughs> I think it's a good album. I know you do. <laughs> <laughs> no. You think our next album is great too? <laughs> I mean, the first album was great. <laughs> I mean, you know, so I, I was. It, 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 I would it, assume it, the third it, one would be good too. Everyone, Yo, coming shout out, shoot shout out to Jesse Reyes, uh, friend of the show. Even though she hasn't been here yet, I support her, and that album is good. Like, yeah. It's good. Yeah. Okay. Now, Dixon, one of my sleepers. I'm, I'm tossing this to Dixon because I feel like all the other people that we've spoken about have bigger budgets. Yeah, so they so. can pay to get the awareness out there. <laughs> Got you. Dixon, I felt like nobody heard him before that <laughs> last project when I go. Well, not a lot of people had heard of him. He's been writing. Mm -hmm. He's been playing instruments. Mm -hmm. He was on Beyonce shit. Oh. Like he's on he's on projects. Yeah. Gotcha. And he dropped Friday. I pre-ordered it. I don't normally pre-order, but if you are a music lover, he does it right. Yo, the songs are not too long. They all flow into each other, and it's abstract, but it's not. Like, it moves. So, I want to play this. I was going to play it as a sleeper, but I'll play another Dixon song as a sleeper. I, I have one as a sleeper. <laughs> it's, it's, it's fine. Dixon and I don't give a fuck. Look what you made me do. Turn Woo, it off right fire. there. That part, that, that, that right there is what I said to God. That shit sounded. Oh, no, I'm about to play it. But that, the, what those drums just did, uh -huh. if that was on the God Did record, like those, the live sounding drums, oh my goodness, Jesus. All right. This record is called Butterfly. Shout out to Dixon, friend of the show, album in stores. Whew. That's fire. <laughs> It continues. All right, you got me. Fire. You got me. It yeah. continues. You got me. That last project you put out was fire, so I'm, I, I downloaded this as soon as I saw it. The last project was all the way fire, but it was only five songs. It was small, nah. and this it was This one's kind of short, too, ain't it? This one is 10. Oh, it's 10? 
This one is Tim's song. The first five is a little more upbeat, eclectic. It's it's jamming, but that six through ten, mm-hmm. he he went somewhere totally it's different. This is thirty he, minutes. Is why I thought it was shorter. Yeah, yeah, he got he got in his slow jam bag, mm-hmm. or not slow, but mid tempo on the second half of the project. So I just like how he did it, man. Shout out to Dixon. He's fire. Can't can't wait to get with him next time he's in New York. You, you if played, I wasn't running around with Symbol all week, I would have got got with Dixon. You've played quite a few Dixon records. <clears throat> Y'all know I'm not the R&B guy, mm-hmm. but I ain't heard one that I haven't. When you turned it off, I'm like, shit, all right, that's hard. You know no, what I'm saying? They, they, they hard. Y'all yeah. joined with uh, Vic Mensa. That's hard. Mm-hmm. Song is dope. That's dope. hard. That's what I was going to play with my seat, but it's dope. <laughs> that, that song is hard. Uh, so I want to congratulate Dixon, man. Go run it up, run it up. Album in your phones right this second. No, nobody at Rock Nation is paying me to say that. Oh, he's Rock Nation? Oh, yeah. I think we had this conversation. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, anything else in music? For me, it was just EST, Jesse, and uh, and Dixon. That's all I got. Let me make sure that that's the case with me, because I'll be buying weird shit sometimes. Hold up. I ain't even had time to look at the music. Shit. I'll be buying I was somewhere. all over the place. So. Yeah, my Apple Music. Oh, I bought this one. You good? See? I found a little weird song that I bought that was hard. How'd you find it? From Music Lovers, of course. What's that? Uh, <laughs> her name is Cecily. S E C I L Y, Cecily or Sicily? Cecily. One person told me about her, then I ignored it because I don't listen to one person. Mm-hmm. Then somebody hit me on Instagram, like, yo, dog, this is for us. And, and then somebody else said, I was like, all right, let me just go listen yeah, to Yeah, that's this. enough. You get it. And it's some, it's some you. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else is going on? A couple singles dropped. Oh, the Glow Rilla remix I bought? I'm such a bird. Nah. <laughs> that shit is hard. Yeah, I, I don't care what you say. That's just that's just hard. That shit hard, bro. I'm sorry. I actually been quite a few um the girl remixes and they kind of kill the shit right now, man. Go ahead. Say hey, something. Yo, if you was a girl, you might be a hoe, yo. Ain't no might about it. No might about it. No might about it. Well wait, hold up. Yo. Wow. Even though I don't think that my, my wholeness would last a long time before I suckered one of these uh, wealthy niggas into taking care of me for life. <laughs> like, I don't think, I see the girls where it's been like a 30 year run. I'm like, damn, you ain't getting, you are still out <laughs> there trucking, <laughs> trooping it around. You hustling backwards, man. Yeah. I think I, I, you'd have got I, one out quick. <laughs> <laughs> quick. <laughs> Fast, two two kids. Fast, yeah, yeah. Lots no, of, I'd, I'd got him. Other niggas, the I'd, thir- I'd thirty got, billion a year niggas. I'd have got one of these. Niggas. They on Nick. Can- Congratulations to Nick Cannon. Round of applause. Mm-hmm. They said he finally had a black baby. Hey, dog. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. Hey, reparations. <laughs> <laughs> pay us, and we won't do it. If you pay us. If y'all give us our shit, we'll stop throwing race and everything. Oh, oh man. shit. Yeah. We could be quiet. We don't want to remind y'all either. Pay us. <laughs> <laughs> well, shut the fuck up. Give us our shit. No, they was oh, going. They said, why, why the black baby moms ain't get the fancy photo shoot in it? They was oh, going. God, they was going. Bro. They was going. Come I know. On. Congratulations, Nick, man. That's all I got for any more. They said he got like a uh, nine yeah, more yeah, coming. I heard three or four. Yeah. 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 Salute. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. That nigga yeah. fuck a lot. <laughs> he fuck a lot. Yeah, I don't want to fuck. I don't want to fuck as much as he got kids. That's a lot of fucking. You ain't lying. Nigga might got the tribe of Shabazz coming. I mean, all right, hold on. If 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 these are agreements, they not even be fucking. That could be true too. Mm. That could be true. It might not even be that. That could be very true. Nah, if I'm yeah, but them the babies that be coming out, you right? No, yo, just. Hey, <laughs> like, I'm, I'm one of them. <laughs> hey, yo, scream, man. No, somebody, somebody back there. Eat. Somebody what? I'm talking to them, not man you. Man up. <laughs> them, them the babies that be coming out. <laughs> I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> Fuck happened to this nigga. <laughs> I'm not like, I ain't like, I'm not like, rewind, uh, <laughs> rewind, please, I ain't about to help. Uh, just keep it going. No, we'll, we'll get that out. Wow. Yeah, you don't say. That's funny though. No, it's not. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Fine. Fucking All right, what else is going on? Come on, you have funny shit over yeah, there. Yeah, come on. Give, give me one of them funnies. Hey, let's shoot it to ish. Give us an example. 
the ish theme song. It does sound yeah. like the ish so theme the song. Yeah, definitely. Said. They, <laughs> they said ish, ish gets so many W's, his name should be Wish. Oh. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's, and shit like that, the only reason I read y'all comments. <laughs> you write that? Yes, I read yeah, that. This guy's a nut, yo. The other one after the Poor Minds episode said, Ish is I scared holes. <laughs> what he said that. Yeah, but he said I didn't know that it was the Ish acronym. You gotta stop doing that, man. Yeah, <laughs> hit the hit the blunt. <laughs> <laughs> Get a little bit of that. Yeah, zombie. you gotta ch- look, 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 look at his face. I did that. Little yes. Bit of that. Tell him, Ice. A little bit of that zombie. Ice, tell him. Parks, <laughs> tell him. Young boys in the back. Yo, Can y'all tell I, him? We know Alex gonna tell him. Go ahead, tell him. What, That's not be what happened. The holes. Don't be bad at me. <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> That's not fair. Yo, take us. We on the fuck. Oh, yo, we, yo, we was there. Oh, we was there. Man. We was there. <laughs> yo, I'm you, my nigga. He be trying to soup the gas Damn. and leave. He yo, this fell. nigga will give up. We hey, wasn't hey, there for this hey, example. Hey, yo, the yo, hoes themselves hey. said you scared them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. Nah. Now you mad at us. I'm not at all. <laughs> I'm not even. You don't scare us. God, <laughs> man. Oh, all right, come on. We wait on itch. We yeah, wait on itch to get some of his shit off. Come on, man. I don't want to serious this out. It's a weekend pod. Nah, you... Parks has some funny shit over there, too. Parks is funny, too. Parks is funny. Parks and H be funny sometimes. Come on, what Brett Favre did, Parks? Oh, oh shit. What, what Brett Favre did? <laughs> Brett Favre is a scammer, man. You got to put him on the list. I knew that from them fucking Wranglers. <laughs> oh, shit. The fucking Wrangler commercial we shoved down our fucking face. Yeah, no, he really did. Him and Carl Malone. <laughs> Yo, Carl was wasn't in the regular right. commercial. I don't know. I was like, he should have been. I was about to say, yeah, <laughs> fucking no. The two fishing together in the back of the truck, <laughs> the Wranglers. I got my I own ideas it. about what, where Carl Malone is and what he's doing. He on one of the islands. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga bought the Epstein mansion. <laughs> that nigga beat my ass if you see me. Facts. I'm letting that thing ring. <laughs> we just told the young kids to put it oh, away. Yeah. That would call the low shoulder. Call so. <laughs> Gotta shoot this shit. Sh- shoulders go, bigger than my fucking nigga, torso. They're gonna choke the shit out of Joe like uh, Vin Rames. Oh, I'm, probably, <laughs> I'm inserting a clip just thinking about this. <laughs> <laughs> Not tumbling with Carl oh, Malone. Oh man, this guy, yo. Yeah, Brett Favre decided that he wanted to get a um a new stadium for his, his daughter's volleyball team. So he just went went ahead and took it from the welfare fund. <laughs> Of yeah. whichever state that was. Think about that. <laughs> Wait, like five how, million. How, how the fuck you do that? I don't know. He's a scammer, man. Fucking took the money. Shout to my nigga Shannon, man. Shannon tore that nigga ass up. As he should. Can somebody give me a little more on this? Yeah. I don't. It was. It was a bunch oh, of people involved. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he, okay. he, he had he had some uh, politicians involved, I believe. Yeah. It's what you know. Hey, what you know is who you know, man. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> I never life, tr- life is relationships. I never trusted Brett Favre. Nah. Like this is right up. This is Wild. right up. Why Wranglers? He already said it. He's a country boy. I don't trust yeah. country boys. Yeah. <laughs> country boy. Yeah, unless, they, unless they kill niggas in rap songs. Uh, country uh, boys. I'm talking about no. Brett Favre was a country boy all up until that Jets contract. Yeah, word. <laughs> he got the fuck out of here. Yeah. Yeah. He said he ain't like it. That nigga put on a North Face. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga was looking like an Harlem nigga up here. <laughs> he got the Tommy Hill figures and shit. Yeah. Brett Favre. He was looking like a Harlem nigga. Shut up, man. Brett Favre made Aaron Rodgers wait nine years. <laughs> Yo. 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 I'm not mad. A Rod was back there just getting why, why sharpening fuck, up, though. Why the fuck you think Aaron Rodgers got mad when they drafted that boy? Yep, you know what time it was. I seen this. My turn, before. nigga. Mm-hmm. Nah, but then he is. saw Jordan Love in practice and was like, "Oh, it's cool." <laughs> <laughs> Cheated on me. <laughs> He's like, I'm glad they got this. I nigga. was a cheat. He, he, that draft pick, that one mistake, about to get me paid. <laughs> Word, <laughs> and that's what it did. I just getting a range. No, Antoine, stop, yo. Yeah, stop, ish. Ice is not getting a range. Ice is not getting a range, man. What year? The ocean. Yep. With the the, the butt, <laughs> you, get, you get the range of the like butt. rock on Canaan. Do that, do with that new range. Every time I walk to my shit, his shit sitting right there. It's like, all right, you playing with me? And somebody got the nerve to have an old range at the parking spot next to him. <laughs> oh wow, you can clearly, that's disrespect. You clearly see the difference in ranges. Maybe right. that's his like um, grocery store range. Nah, he has two. This is girl shit. Ish, Ice can't get a range. Yeah, he cannot get one. He can't. Shit, me. Why can't he? Nigga, because he can't. 
No, off topic. Why can't he? This nigga. <laughs> Can I answer that right now? So go um, ahead, go ahead, yeah, yeah. Get, go ahead. I dim. I'm not getting no ring. <laughs> go ahead and play. <laughs> I'm still weighing whether I want to get my girl a ring or not. I won't. <laughs> so your girl could get one, but I just can't. Yes. Y- yeah. Yes, Antoine. Put some on him. Uh, you got the box. You can play. <laughs> no, I don't I don't Anyway, yeah, anyway I'm either. playing a clip. Play a clip. Let's hear a clip. You can't get a range anything. Music is a state of emergency. <laughs> I sure can. We need badly. We badly need a catchy song right now. This is Shiggy? Shiggy. Because it be, should be it should be no reason I'm moving around and I'm just in my head like, I'm F R E E. Nigga free. I'm I'm And I'm S I N G L E again. <laughs> we need a catchy anthem. You know what I'm saying? It should be no reason I'm talking about. You thought I was feeling you now. That and niggas a munch. Nigga eat either, he no- eat it for lunch. <laughs> he on my body, I get what I want. It oh. should be no it should be no reason I'm saying that at all. I yeah. I shouldn't be saying these things. We need a catchy anthem bad. I should not be saying a nigga's a munch. I am a nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I should not be yeah, but niggas be munches, fuck, man. E fuck nigga free. I shouldn't be saying these things, but I am on a daily basis. <laughs> Help! And Shiggy was definitely a munch. Stop it, yo. Stop yeah, it, he yo. Got, he got a What's point. Wrong with yeah. these niggas. <laughs> he got a point. He's absolutely right. Yeah, he's I correct. said this before, though. I can't wait till Division come up here. Why? Because of what Shiggy just said. I mean, Shiggy just said. You think they can uh, deliver the anthem? No, Division think he made they think an they anthem. Did ah, it. okay. Um, he think he made one. Yeah, remember? Yeah, he did. He did. But fly. even if he's right, and he's he did not. make one, well, he's, he's not. But if he is, and I'm saying Division, but Division is two of them. Daniel, if Daniel is right, let's go with it. Do you want me to be singing that anthem while the girls get to say I'm F R E E fuck nigga free pointing at me and shit in the club? <laughs> I'm supposed to point at them back and say, if I get caught cheating, that don't mean I don't. That bitch will shoot me. <laughs> no, she already going to be shooting you with the ear guns. That's what I'm saying. Oh, yeah, and throwing up a... That's what I'm saying. No, you're right. That's really wild. That's funny. So who could save us? Who you think could do it? Like, remember how... Like, we, we, what we need... Remember when no scrubs came out? And they started Somebody just singing that. It. Niggas came back with the no pigeons. And sporty uh, thieves. I think Moneybag Yo will be the guy. No, he's not he too sassy. He he's saying that. He's saying they lingo. He's saying what he, they say. If the breakup rumors are true. Oh. Gonna get old money bag. Not new money bag, with the money bag's heavier. <laughs> and he was heavier. You're gonna get new money bag. He gonna tell you about tell you about yourself. He gonna go to the brown paperback and the little blogs is pulling up her new nigga allegedly yeah, and all yeah, this. Go yeah. ahead, play, hey, play hey, with rappers. Hey, well, 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 you can't play with him but so much. Go ahead and keep playing with rappers. <laughs> it, hey, homeboy, it's, it's you know it's different. Man. <laughs> Literally, I don't know why the men are having such a hard time coming up with anthem. Probably because the women dictate things, so it's women speaking to women. It's tougher for a man to try to speak to a man or a woman. Well, that's what was happening before. Like the, the men were speaking to the women, and then everybody followed. But now they they're not listening to the men no more. They got the women talking to them. Well, no, and, and to, for a dude to come up with an anthem, it, did, it had to be the perfect song, like Annie up the fucking. That's not a, a, oh, that's not an anthem. No, it's an anthem. But it's not oh. the same type of anthem. DMX joints. I think he's talking about making like a, a dude empowering anthem. No, an anthem. You just need a catchy record. Anthem Something from, that we can sing oh, okay. from a man. Fifty Cent, oh, okay. DMX. Something that we can sing. I thought he was being a little more specific than that. Hey, we're talking about a girl anthem. Ja. Just an anthem. An anthem. We know the anthem is. A due date. I agree with him. Ish, we on the your topic. Is, I ain't saying. I'm waiting for y'all to finish your shit. Come on. Uh, We can talk about. Uh, <laughs> come on. Audience, Ish topics be different, which is why we highlight them. And we love yeah. them. And we love every and we love one that. of them. He don't miss. He will not. Grow down. Stupid, yo. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was a NASA intern. Mm-hmm. This is nuts. Even the first sentence. What the NASA intern did, and how did we find out? 
It should be coming across my line, yo. Um, <laughs> NASA intern literally stole moon rocks that they had in NASA. Okay. Alleged. Okay, allegedly. swag. No, he he locked up. No, I'm talking about allegedly moon oh, rocks. Oh, oh damn, true, true, the guy. true, 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 true. Alleged moon rocks. He spread them out on his bed and had sex with his chick on him. I'm sorry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try to really get his rocks off. That shit. <laughs> <laughs> yo. The nigga... Contaminated the rocks. They locked his ass up for eight years. They should have locked him up for fucking on rocks. Yeah, that's what I'm. Wow, <laughs> that she wasn't was, comfortable. She was with it. That can't be comfortable. That's not comfortable. That can't be comfortable. Yeah, all right. Are they hot rocks? <sighs> yeah, you know I mean, I think it's cold on the moon. They was hot rocks. I think they're cold rocks. Man. We ain't never been there. That's true. <laughs> fucking moon. Who said it's cold on the moon? Mm. Fuck out of here. Look what they did. Look what they did. What she do? Squirt on the rocks? What year was that? <laughs> what year was that? Somebody went to the moon. Seventy nine. 69, I think. 69 or 79. One 69, of them. 69, I believe. That was their version of Instagram. <laughs> Just with the filters and all yeah. that shit. You want to dress this shit up and make it look this way. <laughs> That's all that was. Snapchat do that with everything now. Oh, yeah. Now nah, they said they caught the niggas. WikiLeaks got the information saying that uh, that shit was shot in the Vegas desert. WikiLeaks. <laughs> you know, yo, what you Them be? niggas be having some shit. Those was moon rocks I was throwing at them fans, too. <laughs> Those was moon rocks. Those are Jersey rocks. From the moon. Only moon rocks I know is, 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 is you know, get you high. Moon rock. Moon rocks. Would y'all high? Moon rock. Would y'all fuck a dominatrix? Yes. Yes. Fuck sir. or do all the other shit. It's different, yo. I pop. She can't be tying me up and all that other shit. Yeah, beat the shit out of you. So you, would, so, I'm, so you wouldn't fuck her. Oh, I'm no, not talking just, about would you do what whatever you be doing to chicks. I'm talking about would you do what she Oh, oh be all the, into the, the no, other shit? Be, yeah, get, you're, on, you're, get on all fours. You'll be a, 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 a sub. Cr- crawl you'll around. You'll be a sub. Follow instructions. I was be getting ready. Handcuff, to... A whip, a lash on your arm. You, you'll do that? I'm I was, asking you. I said I was, no. Look, I was no. getting ready to say no. Why are you looking at me? I don't want no sauce, bro. Me neither. But then, depending on who the dominatrix is, I might be willing to listen. Maybe wasn't to listen. Ish wasn't far if, off if, about if, you. I was about to say, I didn't want to say it. Ish, ish was, I ish. said, depending I on who she say, is. Yo, I did not want to say it. Depending on who she is. There's context is. clues. Yo, you be I might good. be willing to listen. Like, what you trying to do? That might not be it's a closet you want. No, I ain't saying nothing about no money. I'm just saying, like, what, what, what are we doing? Definitely, in an apartment. Uh, definitely. I ain't doing a no wild cabinet. shit. Here in an apartment. <laughs> That's a big cabinet. Here in an apartment. <laughs> no, I'm just saying, you know. She going to take that thing and def- it up your... It'll come out the storage. <laughs> oh, no, we're not doing nothing. We're not doing nothing in a while. Like, that's what I said. I will be willing to listen. You were, what are uh, you trying to do? What's the shit called? The little a, gag shit? In the butler's pantry. Yo, 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 come out oh, the garage. The, 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 the little ball. gag shit with the ball? Now, you know how Home Depot got the little shits that you put your supplies in for the yard? Come out of that. What's that the called? The shed. Come out the shed. I ain't <laughs> it's not a closet, whatever you, you in the shed, B? Nah, man. I'm but, just saying, you know. I'm good. As long as it ain't no, you know, I'm cool on certain shit, but I'll be willing to li- listen. I'll entertain a conversation depending on who it is. Well, I'll take, well, I'll take six is playing. Well... <laughs> That guy's good. That was I'm here good. That was good. That was I got good. DVDs for sale right outside <laughs> on your way out. Two, two for six. I mean, speaking of kinky shit, you guys see the uh, the chess player that cheated? How's that kinky? No. Oh, I'm going to get there. Oh, okay. So, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a chess board. Like, how much, how much do you think you could, like, really get off in, in the chess room? You don't know, right? It doesn't seem like much. You're at a board. You sit across from a dude. Yeah, a you got the little you clock. The, you hit the, the yeah, clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he got creative with it. He decided... He's going to go with anal beads. Excuse me. Uh, so what anal kind of, beads. What kind of he moving? Apparently, they were digitized <laughs> anal beads that set off some type of impulse or something when something was happening. Huh? So he had someone sending him signals to his asshole while he was playing chess. And this is all alleged, of course. I, I, I think I mean, he denies these uh, accusations. I, 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 so what played, he's supposed to do, run into it? <laughs> Y'all play chess, right? I do. Yeah, I have, yeah. I mean... Like what? What's the what signal? The fuck? I don't know. Yeah, yeah anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey yo, every time he don't know how to do some shit, he he demoralizes. That's what niggas do. That's what niggas do. Are you bitch ass niggas know how to play chess? Wait, I know. Hey, yo. Oh, Ain't that you, what niggas do? Oh, you mean what you do? Queen to H four, you punk ass nigga. <laughs> I know how to play chess. I didn't say you did. I just ain't ill at it. I, ain't Ill. I know the rules and the moves. I was and shit a bad chess, kid. I, I didn't have time to get good at chess. Most of the kids I knew that were bad actually were good at chess because they were in like uh, glove houses and shit like that. And that's what they did to pass the time. And who? 
What glove the? house is like a uh, it was like a youth youth house. Glove house? That's what it was called up there. Why they call it that? I don't know. What that look like? Niggas have fifis. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I saw a glove move, house. Yo, they wilding with the. So y'all would that. do that to be the best chess player in the world? Would y'all get the you sensory the sensory anal beads? No, because you're not the best chess player in the world anyway. And no. If the dominatrix girl wanted you to get the sensory no. anal beads, <laughs> no. I told you, me and the dominatrix girl would have the conversation and it's certain shit we not doing. You ever came from your G-spot? <laughs> no. I'm asking. No, I'm answering. No, I don't know. I'm answering, no. How about you? <laughs> I mean, Why niggas so niggerish? It's not niggerish. I, I answered your question straight up. The niggas will not be comfortable even in sex. Have you? <laughs> I don't know. How would I know if I did? <laughs> How would I know if I did? You let somebody tickle your G-spot? Where's that? <laughs> on a man? On anyone. M- on a man that's in a prostate. Where's that? <laughs> in your rectum. <laughs> you have a prostate exam? No, nigga, I'm not examining none. You know how foul I live? <laughs> <laughs> Man, if you're over 40, you know, like, yeah, I know. I, 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 I know. <laughs> I pray. Well, you got your shit checked? <laughs> you did. I'm not over 40. Oh, okay. You look it. <laughs> <laughs> Even you might can sneak in. <laughs> You might get sneak in. Let's get this hair BBL. Yo, Doc, I'm 40, man. <laughs> hey, Give Doc, it to me. Check my problem. <laughs> hey, Doc, you snuck in the club? You got a fake ID? Wait till I get this hair what, BBL. What if y'all missing out on like the best nut ever? Y'all don't I'm care? Good. I'm, I'm passing. Cool. All right, come on. I'm not missing out. All right, no, no, no. no, no. Y'all, y'all yeah. think you're trying to defend it. Go ahead. Defend what? <laughs> the the G- butt The G spot orgasm. <laughs> I'm trying to advance the conversation. <laughs> I, you, I bet you fucking That's what are, I'm trying nigga. To do. What else we got? Eliz- uh, Queen Elizabeth, toss to Ish. Come on, Ish. Queen Elizabeth, they uh, did a study with 18 things that Queen Elizabeth owns. Okay. When she passed away. What 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 countries? Quaker. Oh. <laughs> Some of this shit is nuts. Bro. How many? How many people? No, man, go ahead. How many people? Go ahead, bro. I just- <laughs> Come on. Yo, she owns. Y'all all- gonna get bamboozled off the planet? Nah, not me. <laughs> nah, nah, that's. That's the queen. Officially, hey, yeah. I'm just saying. Play with the monarchy. Yeah. No, I'm not playing. Fam, she owns all the dolphins in the UK. And the dolphins. Well, how many dolphins are in the UK? All, Nigga, all of them. <laughs> However many Fam, it is, them. I don't think they'd be out there like how that. How you just own all the animals in a whole country? <laughs> you thought she's, My country, nigga. You thought they were stopping at humans? <laughs> See, see, see. Would, and they say I, human, and they say dolphins good. is smart. I would see want some doing? dolphins. <laughs> that boy, good. See what we doing? That's Think about not, that. You know what? Don't give us reparations, yo. I'm gonna do the same thing. Buy people? No, no. <laughs> and it's one of the dolphins. <laughs> oh, you buy the dolphins? Every one of them. I ain't gonna tell niggas not. in the yard hopping around. <laughs> the yard. What else? What else? Y'all? Like the ho- <laughs> <laughs> Yo, did you zoom in on that? Was the ish cam? <laughs> I saw that she owned a gold plate. Apparently, she was a, an ama- allegedly she was an amazing Nintendo Wii bowler. So she was gifted a twenty-four karat gold Wii controller. I think I just got one of them too. No, the that's the fake gold. Whatever, they, whatever they sell on Newark. Uh, the green shit, bra- shit, turn your shit green. <laughs> bra- <market>. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, dog. What else? What else she what did? What the fuck? She was. She uh she had the best seats in the whole Wimbledon. She um owned the Tower of London. Some like some other shit I never yeah, heard of. Traffle Gold Square. She owned a team of race horses. Queen Victoria's racist sketchbook. horses. Definitely some niggas. <laughs> racist horses. It's niggas missing off that list. I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> race horses and racist horses. Yo, she owned the world's largest clear cut diamond. Now, now, now slow down <laughs> Bar- Maybe borrow Slow down oh, how, she, how, she, how she get it Let me hold that for a minute How she get it Nah 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 I got you Where's from But didn't she inherit these things Yeah from yeah, Some people things. Some people took them That's, that's what, that's what they inher- call it Inheritance, inheritance from niggas <laughs> <laughs> Hey nigga Give me that And then I'm gonna give it to you my know, kids She owned a tiara That big ass crown She used to be wearing She had 1,333 diamonds in it Again Some of them she took Borrowed from India they weren't rapper diamonds or nah. No, 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 no. It's one them. Yeah, no, yeah, this ain't. No, no, the little pen shit. Ain't no Jacob. Ain't no Jacob. No, 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 no. Ain't no pen. Ain't no Jacob. They catch Queen Elizabeth. Where she not supposed to be? She gonna be a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> mm, no, she got some niggas. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, well, yeah. She, she hires oh, yeah. security. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kit Kat. She don't go out with others. Run, run, run up. Yeah, run up if you want to. Run where Kit Kat won't know. You won't take a step to her, Queen Elizabeth. Yo, uh. She got they made Jacob diamonds, nigga. Them Johannesburg diamonds. I see you rappers going into Jacob too. I, oh I yeah, peep. they better go. 
I know, but I see more of them going. Mm-hmm. They not post them? Don't get me started, yo. Help me out. That nigga selling these niggas some bullshit. I think they all are. They look yeah. like bullshit. <laughs> Why wouldn't he? Yeah, dumb nigga. Let me g- give me your money. I mean, not for nothing. I'm I not thought, saying he would. I'm, I'm not trying to be a dick. Damn near every jeweler does that. Yes. To, it, to everybody. I know. We don't. You got to we don't. We don't know all of their first names through hip hop. <laughs> That's my issue. God, I'm not mad at the scams. I'm not mad at none of the scams, yo. We know, but you got to think about it. His watch was Jacob and Company, and people just called it. Give me the fly carpenter from earlier Mm -hmm. that you saw pictured in that watch. That is my point. That's a good point. That's a great point. But anyway. What else the queen owned, man? 150,000 different works of art. Something like. You know. Something like. Hey, yo. She probably got those... uh, Art is where these wealthy them. people really floss. And no, know what the they best be, money they be laundering. Washing they money, yeah, though. it's money laundering. They be washing their bread through the art. I know, and we out here buying barbershops and laundromats. <laughs> 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 they do, they wash doing my the way, money through they the shape. They doing it the way it's yeah. supposed to be. I'm done. shaping it up. I'm washing. Yo, that's crazy, my nigga. She owned uh, Henry VIII's armor, a <laughs> national collection of mulberries. Oh, yeah, the Marbury's was hard. That's what's up. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. Well, I mean, how much was them worth? Them shits was $10. They was $20 a piece. <laughs> yeah, it was under Armour. So like, why that's on the yeah, list? The queen know? wanted that, too? Yeah. Hey, put that on. Give me that shit, Stan. <laughs> all of them. Give me a tattoo, <laughs> I want all too, of it. Yo, <laughs> a bat colony. And huh? Batman. <sighs> you know wait, she wait, owned Batman. A bat- Sorry, guys. It is what it a is, man. Colony? How do you think Batman got rich? <laughs> That's why they caught his ass in the alleyway as peoples. <laughs> Yo, uh, it's a blood sacrifice. I'm, I'm also interested with all, <laughs> yeah. all, the, yeah, all of the different islands and, and that was like, yo, for the next two weeks, for the next three weeks, for the we, next- We gonna mourn the queen. We mourning, we shutting it down. Mm-hmm. No mail, <laughs> no this. Think about that, no. dog. To somebody that just basically conquered you, had you under their thumb for the last I'm cool. half a century. Stockholm Syndrome. That's exactly what it is, Ice. She owns half of the UK's shoreline. That's it? Think about that. Wait, only half? <laughs> you niggas is crazy. That is nuts, B. Man. She owns the British seabed. Homie trying to get by the whole shoreline. offshore wind farm. When the big ass whole uh-huh. wind turbine, yeah. she owns one. That's hers, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. Shit. That makes sense. The, you, you, the UK's black. continental <laughs> shelf. these black the what? <laughs> That's why the hurricanes and shit was happening. <laughs> That's what that was. Yo, turn it up on these niggas, yo. Turn it up on these niggas. <laughs> the wind for it. That's a nigga fan. <laughs> that niggas under the earth like, <laughs> yo. Oh, we, we gonna get man. Drunk. Yeah, nah, she owns UK's continental shelf. It's like the edge of the, like, it's like a drop there. <laughs> she owns the edge of the world. <laughs> yo, world. She owns all of Scotland's gold mines. All of them. All right. What her grandparents was into, yo. Like, yo, dog. What they was doing. We know that. what they were into. Yeah, you know, you know, I, the I, I know. I didn't go to school. Inform me. What no, they no. Conquering the world is what they were they into. They must have really won. Nah, at one point, they owned, they owned something stupid. I forgot what. It was a ridiculous percentage of the world. Bro, at, the, at one point, but this is England, not Rome. Rome is mm. in Italy. I don't know when. I'm just. <laughs> no, wait, none of that shit is. You bad at the <laughs> It's by <about> Greece. <laughs> Oh, uh, you know what I mean, it's like nah. But they, at one point, they they said that um, like the Roman Roman Catholic Church in Rome. At one point, they had a slogan that the sun never sets on Rome because they owned so much of the world mm-hmm. that it was sunny in one place that they owned all day long. In hip hop, we have a saying: the sun don't shine forever. <laughs> <laughs> but Yo, as long as it's here, we might as well shine, shine together. together. The queen, yeah, ain't, the queen ain't turn on the nigga fan. Ain't <laughs> <laughs> no fucking shine together. <laughs> Yo, no, no. hey Charles, plug that in. <laughs> That'll teach them. Uh, <laughs> it's like a different type of money, yo, that you couldn't even. Ever it's fat. beyond it's no, everything the Romans said. What else the niggas said? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, whole life has been dedicated to Rome. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid, yo, yo, o- over, over. Uh, this, this another thing about them. What like, else? You know, shit just been coming out. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Tell me. Over eight hundred brands, like real brands, um, have to now reapply to use the royal 
signature shit on a product. So like Heinz ketchup, that little um crown. They have Heinz been one of them this whole time. Yeah, yeah, nigga. I'm, I'm moving to hunt. See, that's why I'm. See, that, that's why we took that shit off the Steeler Stadium. That's why you got tapped the bottle so much. <laughs> <laughs> it's paying homage to the queen. <laughs> nah, for real, for real. Like, yo, dog, these niggas. Uh, you gotta reapply because they officially use certain shit mm-hmm. that gave people the um license, license. permission yeah, or the yeah. license to use their shit. Yeah. So now, let's just say the son don't use it. Fuck you, Hans. Fuck out here, we use it. That's nuts, B. They getting licensing deals. They got turbines. They got dolphins. How many record labels you got under her? That's a good Probably question. Probably half a Very death row. Very good question. You know they got them. Yeah, they got them. They, yeah, start, they, got them. they started death row. <laughs> Yo, the fuck you think Chug got it from? What you talking about, nigga? This is when it's going to get fun. That little young, young, young one. The kid, the young, young one. Mm. I don't know whose kid he is. Because I don't be paying attention. But me and my mom have watched him at all the little events that they throw. Uh, the little. At all the <laughs> big events that they throw. The royal. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yo, find out the, the young, the tiny, tiny one. The young, young, young. The little five, six, seven-year-old one that be there hitting people. <laughs> throwing boogers. White <laughs> that little nigga start an international conflict. Uh-huh. No, whenever he takes over. <laughs> it's up. Oh, it's yeah. up. He don't give a fuck about none of that Yo, shit. Bruh. It's up. You, you gotta watch. Yo, did you start watching whatchamacallit? Yo. <laughs> uh, I finished those art. <laughs> no, not that. Game of Thrones, the new one. No. The new one. No. Should I? You want me to good. read all these books and catch up with this shit? You don't read, read no books. books? <laughs> now you gonna lie and say you read? I read Twitter. <laughs> I got mad books on top of my toilet. You kidding me? That, did no, you that, read did them? You, Amarion just sent me his new book. Did you read them? <laughs> What's the name of it? <laughs> unbothered. Watermelon Fisher? <laughs> How I Became Unbothered. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh shit. Shout out to Amarion. Let me not read that. I want to be bothered. I'll just skip right to the end. If I'm unbothered, ain't no pot. He, he was bothered too. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was a lot more bothered in Mario than he was. How, how do I breathe? <laughs> what he should have been bothered over. That's my man. <laughs> That's your man? Amarion? Yeah. Ain't saying nothing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's my man. That's cool. I can't. I don't want no. You think, you think I'm in the shed with him? <laughs> I ain't in the damn shed. Hey, shut the <laughs> fuck up. <laughs> uh, all right, so all these different brands can't use the, the logo, the symbol. None of that shit that they for. had licensing with because now, quote, unquote, the royal house don't necessarily use that shit no more because now it's up to the new person in charge. King King Charles. That is insane to me, dog. Oh. I want to say something, but I can't say it. I'll tell you off, Mike. Y'all seen him? I did. Prince Charles? I mean, King Charles? Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> yeah. Scared, you scared of the throne? Hmm? You scared of the throne? Oh, them niggas could snap their fingers <laughs> this podcast. Nigga, you heard what she just owned, Oh, right? for, yeah. yeah. No, no, no. You think Joe Budden's name wouldn't be on that list? <laughs> yeah, the Joe Button pod. Then you'll really be in the shed. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> if I was King Charles, see, that's why that monarchy shit ain't for over here. Because if I was now the king, I had to wait 80 years. Now I'm 90. <laughs> some bullshit. <laughs> that is some I'm, bullshit. Yeah, be pissed niggas, off. That nigga's like 80 him damn so. Yeah. He ain't know what was happening. <laughs> it's like Biden. <laughs> I'll get away saying it. Hey, it sounds familiar to me. <laughs> I could really, we could really have fun with this, but I'm a, I, I want, it's like, the I'm, I'm listening, go ahead. I, I just want to hear what y'all Hey, and bleep that out. Anyways, <laughs> yo, that ESTG shit, yeah, I man, can't man. wait to hear that in different play, like in the car. Woo! I never felt none. Shout out to Simba. I miss the V era of hip hop. Anyway, um, the V, vehicle, V. Nigga. What? I be wanting to hit this nigga. Uh, you, I hate this sometimes. nigga sometimes, bro. What? Tell me why. Why do you miss the V era? Just that time in hip hop. That was a good time. It's not. It's not existing anymore. Yeah. They, no. They don't call no vehicle V. What are you talking about? They call, call it, it the whip. You. They call it the whip. It's Same shit. No, they're not calling. The no, you just don't drive no more, so you miss. Yeah, the that's v what I'm saying. That's why you. Oh, you that's what y'all are saying. Yeah, nigga. Y'all will find a way get to out, bring, out, bring out get on the capitalist road. shit. Hey, hit the car wash, hey, so, nigga. Get clean. Hey, so hand me the ox. 
And today the ox was broke. I said, hey now. <laughs> so you make so much money to have a time out. Hold up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you do not get dropped off here. <laughs> you, <laughs> yo, hold up. And now that you mention it, I Hey, fam. I know so be tight. I fam. can't explain. No, yeah, please. I'm I can't explain. I, no, I, I can't you explain. New, you had to go to New York this morning. Huh? I don't you had to go to New York this morning. No, uh, I'm listening. <laughs> no, I, I was trying. Yeah, no, I really want to hear this. It was time for service on my car. I took my car over there to Englewood. Right? <laughs> Them niggas told me that I would get. How many miles you put on your car, y'all? Thirty-one hundred. Damn. See. Your car needed a service after 3,000 miles? Yeah. yeah. Service A. Series A of the service. So wait, I wait, it. hold on. You don't, you don't do that? My car never needed a service after its initial yeah, 3,000 miles. You better stop lying. <laughs> <laughs> you better stop lying. Go ahead, right, you never had the car that needed one of them. <laughs> 3,000 mile service? Yeah. I don't think I've I ever always... had a car that only had 3,000 mm. miles on it. <laughs> really? No, I'm, I'm, I've okay. always done it my damn self. <laughs> Yo, you bought a car with zero yeah. miles on it. Before? Yes, uh, I didn't. I'm just. Saying. I never have. Yeah, I have. I'm not. I'm not. Like and, no, you bought. Well, you drive a lot though. Um, no, I took my car in there, right? And this was the new shit that I had never heard before. They said there were software updates that needed to be done. Needed to be done on my car, but I should get it right back. So then they text me, of course, at the end of the day to say, Wi-Fi bad. Yeah, we can't get this done today. We'll do it tomorrow. So, of course, they text me th tomorrow at the end of the work day to say, yo, there was a glitch. So, the software updates, Sorry, we couldn't get them done. Shit. Hoping that you can get it Friday. They had to format that shit. I was just thanking God because I remember when Mercedes would do that shit and I would be steaming because I don't want to be in a loaner. I don't got a driver. Just take the fucking... Give it back when the software updates are <laughs> finished, yeah, that I suppose. That's, that's, yeah. that's different. Y'all like these the the windows? They're nice and clear. Oh yeah, they, they, have, see more, right through they have more than clear. So I had had a window cleaner come over here. Yo, yeah, let's get to Joe Buddy. Hey, yo, this nigga's a different type of elitist. Yeah, off, I ain't gonna hold off you. mic, he's telling us he got the windows cleaned yeah. and they cracked my muffin. So how am I an elitist? I was complaining. <laughs> you didn't complain. I did. You was like, no, you clear, right? Yeah, nigga charged me an arm and a leg, but they mad clear, I right? I said he cracked my muffin, which was the complaint. And I said, yo, how much did he charge you? And no, let him tell you. Let him tell. You. I want him to say. It. Six hundred. <laughs> this nigga got all of nine windows in this bitch, and somebody charged this nigga six hundred dollars. Look at that window, ish, fam. Joe, I wouldn't I, there's care. There's one, two, if, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, them big ass one. I don't know. He could have got me. No, no he, he could have got, got, got you. No, no, he got you. you. No, you could have got me. Cause y'all think I'm cleaning the window. That's what you could have did. Call me next time. No, and, and that's the story you think I want to hit the internet. Joe got his friends cleaning the window. <laughs> I, I'd have done it for five hundred. He's yo, a horrible friend. Yo, nigga, we just started competing. You no, said no, five hundred. No, I'd do it for four fifty. Word. Yeah. Fuck is you crazy? <laughs> oh well, shit. I'll call you niggas next weekend. Then <laughs> one of y'all get over. Oh, here. Do, I got some, some windows. A weekly bump? Yeah, I got that. Dog. They clean though. They ain't. Nah, because they I'm going to talk shit. They ain't really that clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you yeah, really want to look at it, really, I mean, you really think about it. I wouldn't have left that spot. You know what I'm right saying? They ain't yeah. used the newspaper. I think I see a some bum ass bounty. What I told y'all want me to bring the homeless nigga in with the squeegee board, squeegee yeah. board shit. Homeless nigga <laughs> had that shit clean, too. Right, Yo, would. Rashidi would have this motherfucker <laughs> sparkling. <laughs> For how much, Ish? Yeah, Keep yeah. It, tell him. Yo, but why did Ish put a black name on this person? <laughs> That's racist. <laughs> that is racist. But those are from my hood. That's the nigga. I was getting ready to say, I ain't never seen nobody. In Your hood. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Rashiki in Short Hills now, right? I know. I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Any, I'll, anywho, I'll moving up. right along. Yeah. Did we have any more of the good ish topics? You got more, man. Uh, Cardi B settled. She settled her case when she went to go beat them bitches up. Ah, <laughs> y'all bitches can't get the queen. Niggas, you settled. Shoot first, ask questions last. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Stop playing, I'm joking. Man. <laughs> Yo, landlord in Vegas had a stipulation in his lease agreement that you had to give him some box before you moved in, and really had a contract stating it. How nice was the building? <laughs> huh? Look at you getting contractor <laughs> ideas. <laughs> Look at you trying. Like, oh, so you can do that? You trying to expand? <laughs> Yo, nah. But the crazy shit is, where does everybody stand? If if somebody signed it, ish. 
I wanted to I, ask a question. I'm, I'm not, not trying to the dude. I'm not trying to be funny. I'm serious. <laughs> no, they locking them up. Why? Are so you saying if they they, they agreed to it? No, they locking them up. Yo, but the people agreed to it. They were willing participants and in my, that. And that is my point right there. Like, yo, if somebody said, yo, this is a, especially it was in Vegas where prostitution is legal. Uh, is that? What? It doesn't seem right though. And it's, it's legal. prostitution legal, legal and right in don't in have Boston, to be the same thing. But he got locked up, yeah. so it yeah. clearly wasn't yeah. legal. Oh, I must be fucking with the bitches that still got to creep around in. They, they be hiding this. Thing. <laughs> 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 like, meet me over the bitch. It's legal. <laughs> Just come on. Nah, they, yo, dog. You know you be in Vegas. They be having flyers. A box. Buy one, get one free. <laughs> Bottles a hundred dollars. Shit like that. Shit, I could be Ladies with. night. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Buy one, get one. Eric, get the camera off me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ice Ish and Parks cam it up. Yo, no. Cam it right on up. But, dog, think about that. Like, if, if, if what? Chicks are selling box for money, you <laughs> could sell box for a security deposit. <laughs> no. <laughs> what, what, so what, what say you? I feel like that's dangerous for the landlord because <laughs> she might fuck up the apartment and all you got out of it was some pussy. He might, there might be some pussy he's willing to take the risk on. All right, cool. See, see what that trick and bags. This go trick, trick, trick. Dangerous, in? dangerous, slippery slope. I, I agree. I, just, <laughs> I thought it was funny to read. Like, yo, it's funny to listen to. <laughs> Glad they got him off the streets, though. Sounded like a menace. Criminal, thug, horror to the community. Terrorist. Terror. Sounded his paying for rent for box. <sighs> I mean, the nerve of him. <laughs> you got some more issues over there? No, you can't. Just. It's just for bartenders. Huh? Hmm? Nothing. Wait, you, you... Excuse me? That was just for bartenders. It wasn't for tenants. Got it. So... Cool. <sighs> Go ahead. I don't want no sauce. Yo, Joe, they sleeping on anything sleep. over there? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah like, <laughs> just go to sleepers. It's cool. Kanye and Gap? Uh, again? Again. I just want I want to hear from Gap. Me in, I, I want to hear from, from Gap one day. You never will. Yeah. You never will. Nope. Or Adidas. Nope. Did we ever hear from Nike? No. Nope. What what what's the new thing? Tell me what the new thing is. He, he he's out of contract. Yeah, he's allegedly. Bad. Yeah. They they See, I need more confirmation than him just saying uh they I'm, I'm out of it. I'm out to not just take what he said as this is what's happening. But apparently they still are doing the Balenciaga Gap. Yeezy. It's when, just it, when his lawyer Yeezy. hit him two weeks ago and was like, give Gap 10 days, they gave Gap them 10 days to do whatever it is that they was trying to do. I don't know what they was trying to do, but the fact that he backed down said, all right, there is something that should be put on the table that could make you chill. So all of this, I left Gap, I left, I left. Ah, who knows? <laughs> who knows? Yeah. And we won't ever hear from Gap, so who knows how the contract ended? Who knows yeah, how to do this? It's big business. But I see him trying to take control of his own brand. I yes. like that. Yeah, no, no. I like that part. Definitely. I like that part. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Larry Jackson leaves Apple, allegedly. Yeah, I saw that. Really? What a run. What a run. Wow. He did a lot while he was there. Yeah, Anybody yeah. know what he's going to do? Some other big shit, I'm sure. Was of course. No, I was asking, was it disclosed? No, nah, I don't think so. Gotcha. Larry's my man, so I won't speculate on his business. Uh, incredible run. Everybody knows who he is and what he has done, responsible yeah. for a lot of those Apple deal exclusives mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. just a lot of content over there. He helped shape them. He did. He did. For Lar sure. Large part in their identity. Large part. So where he's going, I don't know. I imagine it to be big. Of course. Why he's leaving, don't know. Who knows? I imagine it to be big. Like at that level, yeah, this, you can't, this, yeah. it can only be big now. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. It's kind of like Ab above my the, pay grade. I'm like the Tom Brady shit. Like I'm gonna leave to do something other that dope shit, step, but it's yeah. gonna be high level shit. Mm -hmm. Yo, I want mm -hmm. I want niggas to watch. Um, it's a doc. Uh oh, called uh, it's suggesting docs. Inside job. Oh, I saw it though. You saw it mm -hmm. about the banks and the, mm -hmm. <sighs> the shit had me hot and damn near sad. Was this about the uh, home lender crash shit? That played a part in it, but okay. it was talking about how um, the government, like, so Corey, 
uh-huh. could be responsible for a trillion dollar loss of this one particular company, mm-hmm. right? And they shitting on them, and now the government had to come bail the company out because Corey did such a fucked up job, and Corey ran away with all his money, and blah, 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 blah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The next presidential administration will hire Corey as the head of finance or the head of the treasury. You know what I'm saying? And then Corey will go do some more fuck shit. And go be on the board of directors at this college and this college and this company over here, getting three, four hundred grand a pop from each one of the entities, and then Goldman or hire them. Like this shit is just insanity, my nigga. Of how Bro, these- do you see the uh, New York Times article about the senators that are taking taking playing the stock market to their advantage? Well, we do. I know. No, we know. We do that. They, 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 they did. What did that say? What is it? Uh, they just had a list of you know. Um, Senator from here, it was in control of whatever defense and had all these contracts with defense and sold it when such and such happened and bought it when such and such happened. Yeah, we know that's been happening. No, no, no. I'm going to ask y'all a real question here. Yeah. If either of you were in the position to get some and use your connections, your relationships, inside information to make you some money, would you do it? What are the ram- what are the repercussions? Yeah, th- yeah. this sounds a slap on the wrist if you get caught. Th- that's the, because that's the because of part. your relationships, they don't suffer no consequences. That's what right. I'm saying. Why like why do we? Well, what they're are, doing is actually surprised? I think it's legal as of now. It can't be. Like if you know, I, like if I sit on the board, no, if I'm I'm a congressman, yeah, and a bill now comes on my desk. Give me an example. Of what you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> A bill comes on your desk. Yeah, on, You're on, a congressman. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you can't help it. You can't help no, it. No, we here now. This is the shit. Yeah, Lock- Lockheed, shit Lockheed Martin is proposing building a hundred million, a um, hundred jets, yeah. and these jets is twelve billion dollars a piece, mm-hmm. right? You know, you' about to vote on it. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy some Lockheed Martin stock because I know the Congress is about to pass the bill to give them the. Shit. And nigga, that and, should be and, illegal. And look, that look, should definitely look, be illegal. And I'm gonna talk to my other constituents. That's like, true. yo. It sounds illegal. Let's that get this. Be illegal. It's illegal if I do it. Definitely. No, it was illegal when Martha Stewart did it. Mm-hmm. Not the real illegal. <laughs> That's that wasn't the real illegal. Martha came out, hit Snoop, <laughs> did a cooking show, sold a new blanket. <laughs> did, did, they ain't really. That's the point. They, ain't, they put her in some beautiful shit. That's the point. No, so, no that's yeah, after not, she came home. That she got that's all that. Yeah, yeah, that's amazing. They that treated her cool. well when she was in there too. Hell yeah, yeah they Good treated old. her well. I treat her well too. And that probably don't happen if it wasn't on. <laughs> you do what? I said I treat her well. What? Elaborate. I like Martha Stewart. Give us an example. How well would you treat her? Erection like? M- m- <laughs> munch like? Like you like her? <laughs> <laughs> no, you would get erect for. Her? Please if I say mix it. the yellow with Wait, the Wait, time out. If I mix the time yellow out. with the Nobody gray. say a word. If you answer this correctly. <laughs> we are. <laughs> we are. <laughs> are, are we are gone. Kaboom. Are right, we going to keep it a buck? No, are you going to keep it a buck? I'm going to keep it a buck. I will bust Martha Stewart ass, B. Yeah. <laughs> Don't put us in shit with my name. Oh, okay. <laughs> This nigga be potting, yo. This nigga be potting. Okay. It'll be a little boy toy for Martha. And Martha's uh, company. <laughs> <laughs> Let me call my little nigga out here. <laughs> no. You don't pop Martha? Martha got a little, what'd you call it? A windfall? A wind fan? She got a little. <laughs> All that. <laughs> Some flowers. Some dolphins. Some flowers. Hey, get that she fan got... on blow your little nigga ass little out t- here. <laughs> <laughs> Had a little dolphin, dolphins <laughs> playing in your SMM. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They call him Ice because he does this thing with Ice. That <laughs> <laughs> I see where the nickname came from. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. oh, it's something to marvel at. Stay right there, Tom. You wow, yo. <laughs> All right, come on. What else is important? I'm sillier in the new place. I'm well, silly, I'm silly in the new place. place. Yeah, yeah. I'm Jersey silly in the new place. Like, get you canceled, silly. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know you're not. Yo, it was fucked up when they, uh, Dion Warwick was at, um, was at the tennis match and they called it Gladys Knight? Nah. Why they do that? Uh, all, all black people look like. Yo, it was terrible, dog. Dion Warwick with the short haircut. It's like, yeah, we got Gladys Knight over there. I was like, <laughs> That's not funny. 
terrible. That's not funny. That yo, is terrible. Yo, they do. They just said it like they knew what they was talking about. Kept the pushing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's your cousin. Oh shit. Um, Nikki is suing a blogger for saying some bullshit. I'm in a round of applause. Yep. I like it. Yep. I don't. I don't care where she got the idea from. <laughs> Accountability. Get that money. Accountability to you. Yep. I'm you not can't mad. just say things about people. Yeah, I'm waiting for somebody to slip up, say something about me. The bullshit is anything y'all say be true. The <laughs> second that y'all say something that's not true, and you meant malicious intent, and I can prove it. No, and yes. and oh, I got to prove uh, that I suffered loss too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. That it affected no. you. No, there's two kinds of loss. I'm gonna crack one of these. And I'm gonna crack one of y'all. What's the, what's the one where um? You by the time y'all do it to me, I'm gonna have the money to do it too. These niggas just got the money to blow. Mm-hmm. Cardi was in court for three. That was 2018. They said the girl moved. It's four years. No, they said the girl moved. Mm. Yeah, she moved. To Africa. <laughs> you think I'm joking? They said the girl moved so she wouldn't have to pay Cardi. She left the United States. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Uh, if it's saying. true, it's funny. If it's fake, it's funny. I don't. It's like, either, either way, I'm peeing on myself. <laughs> I'm dead ass. They said Yo, the girl. Was, they had a little interaction recently. <laughs> oh, her and a girl on on Instagram. And why? <laughs> we so messy. <laughs> what happened, girl? <laughs> <laughs> nah, it, 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 it was girl. Something Cardi has said, but no. she never said Shorty's name. So, so I, guess a, I guess a block. No, 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 no. Listen, no, listen. <laughs> Uh, one of them blogs, you know how they, you know how they screen cap report the shit, <laughs> mm-hmm. and Shorty jumped in the uh, mentions like, "Yo, somebody say my name." Cardi jumped right under there. Nah, but what, send my check. Oh, Tasha K, you talking about? Yeah, I'm talking about the other girls that they plead out about the fight. But Tasha K, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But that was important because in those litigations, you know, you have your paperwork that say, "All right, you can't talk about her, mm-hmm. you can't talk about her," and if you do, there's fines exactly. and penalties attached. Sure. So. Yeah, but I think in that, I understand what Taja K was saying. Because if you talk about anything related to this, I might be uh, exonerated of some of that shit that I had to pay. So it's like, oh, hey, hey, somebody say something under here? Nope. Nope. No, bitch. <laughs> now, <laughs> now, send it over. <laughs> <laughs> nah. You can't actively tell me that you're not going to pay me because you don't, you don't, can't afford it to pay me and then try to get out it's, of it. it. Yeah, no. One or the other got to happen. Well, anyway, they said Shorty. It was a rumor saying Shorty moved to Morocco to to slip the jab. Yo, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> but where did you hear it or read it? I, I don't Instagram. on a blog site. They, they all that's <laughs> true. <laughs> bitches in Miami. <laughs> 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 bitches at Tootsie's. <laughs> at Tootsie, Joe. Oh, oh shit. shit! Movie trap. Uh, so Spence versus Crawford. Whew. Spence versus Crawford. Uh, I had inside information that said this was done a few months ago or at least a month and change ago, mm. but I didn't believe it. And those things kind of fold at the last minute sometimes, so I wasn't going to say it, but mm-hmm. looks like word is out. It's final. This is happening. They've both been training. Mm. November's around the corner. This is the one. Oh, that's what it is, November? November 4th. Woo. This, this is the that's one. That's right around mm-hmm. the corner. This is the one. Yeah, it's definitely This one. is the mega fight. Yeah. This is our Tyson Holyfield this is our Hearns, Hearns Hagler, Hearns Ray Leonard. Or Mayweather Pacquiao. Yeah. Just mm-hmm. those fights that you were waiting for the whole boxing world. Who you got? They both dumb, yo. They are. Yeah. They both dumb. I don't know enough about boxing to say which one of them is better. Yeah. I go by eyes. And when I look at both of them, they look ill. I'm more impressed by the nigga that got in an accident because Spence. he shouldn't look like that. <laughs> He should not. Um, Crawford just looked like a machine, you know, like different, like robot. Spence got in a. He should have been finito, right? Yeah, or at least back down to human boxing. So I'm going Spencer. Sure. The accent, dude. Yeah, yeah, I think I am. He's a monster. I think I am too. I don't know. No, I just want to watch the fight. Yeah, I just want to watch the fight too. Yeah, or, I think I I'm, a ca- to I'm a casual. Know. I think. Yeah, I'm yeah, going, me too. I'm a me casual. too. But I think I'm going Spence. Yeah. If we have more time, I call Royce and ask him who he would pick. Because he's the boxing fanatic. Yeah, he had hard, yo. Huh? He has Crawford. Really? Got it. Royce picked Crawford. Royce is pretty good at that. Yeah, no, he's a, he's super into boxing. Mm. Oh, I'm picking Crawford then. <laughs> Look how fast that. <laughs> no, I'm still rolling with Spence. I'm still rolling. Listen, the fans won. 
True. I know yeah, where I, mean, I will be in November, the night of that. No question. Fight. You had to see me last night searching the channels trying to find the uh Oh, it took me a minute too. Yeah, 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 it took me a minute too. Oh, that shit is annoying. Yeah. It was nice though. It, it was, was like, nice. Once I found it. Once I found it. It was nice over Am- there. Amazon, 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 Amazon Prime. Yeah. It was enjoyable if you had good Wi-Fi. Right. Mm. If you did not have good Wi-Fi, that shit was I could see how that would be a nightmare. Yeah. Skipping yeah. around, pausing. I went to the hookah spot. They got two TVs next to each other. I was uh, befuddled. One was mad behind because of the Wi-Fi, yeah. I'm assuming. Uh, and one was way ahead. Yeah. Oh, that that's, that's, the, that's the problem with that streaming shit. And I like I it. I mean, too. I don't know... I don't know how they're set up, but we've been we've been to a spot that we frequent, and they had a uh, what was the fight of uh, the the Javante Davis fight, the last one, and they were showing that in Chippendales. Nigga, what <laughs> the fuck, yo? <laughs> you said the spot y'all like the freak. We don't. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't know, know nobody where named Chip or Dell, nigga. I know the Rescue Rangers, but well, continue. Sure. <laughs> they had the um, <laughs> so when all this shit be on the streaming shit, niggas is getting the fire sticks and all mm-hmm. of that. Niggas ain't paying for it in the hood spots. <laughs> so the shit was like yeah. half this. This shit was like a two minute delay. The knockout happened. This whole side down there screaming. These niggas watching. <laughs> 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 and then like two minutes go by. This side starts screaming. It's the funniest shit in the world, man. That's that's, that's, that's all that that's funny. Shit. See what the hood. I'll tell you one thing. The camera flashed. They showed a picture of Jeff Bezos sitting next to Roger Goodell. Mm. <laughs> Did you see that? Dog. Dog. <laughs> I didn't see it. Yo, all due respect to Roger Goodell. I know who you be. But boy, it looked different when you sitting <laughs> next to Jeff Bezos, yo. <laughs> Jeff Bezos' skin, posture, suit... The girl rubbing his thigh while he was talking like <laughs> that nigga swag. He good around anybody but Leo DiCaprio. <laughs> Jeff is alright. He made that Roger Goodell a little football money look like look like oh, that's that, oh, that's look like oh, oh somebody left me mean? an invite in my mailbox. Let me <laughs> let me oh this was sweet. Oh nice. <laughs> what a kind gesture. Yeah. Roger Goodell looked ashy next to <laughs> Jeff Bezos. <laughs> Hair looked undone, eyebrows a mess. <laughs> Everything was dusty on him. That, that's the 700 million versus 2 billion, 3 billion. And if you notice, who was doing most of the talking in that, in that talk? I ain't see it. What it was Roger Goodell. <laughs> Roger Goodell going to get him some more of them. Yeah, he's <laughs> he getting some more games. I had another idea there, uh, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> hey, good old Jeff. Hey, try- hey, hey, they are trying to find a, a buyer for the uh, Sunday ticket. And all JB. Listen, listen, JB. Uh, <laughs> you nicknamed him. Huh? Nicknamed. Yeah, him. yeah, yeah. He yeah. owns JB, oh, yeah. by the way. Yeah, you can't be JB. You tell your neighbors, no. You gotta be something else. No, I sold that in my amp contract. <laughs> I ain't JB, nigga. I'm make up a niche, whatever you want it to be. <laughs> make up some ugly shit. I'm XT. <laughs> you in the in the shed with ice? You sell my shit. <laughs> you Damn, my shed. price way higher than him. I ain't in no shed. I'm, my price. I'm in a car. My, my price, nigga. <laughs> you need, you need a penthouse to get this ass. <laughs> Yo, oh, my Lord. Yo, don't, don't even leave this right. way. Yeah, word. Go that way, Yo, you stop. You bleeding on the couch. <laughs> Yo, come on, man. Stupid ass jeans. <laughs> what the hell? Yo, this nigga's stupid, yo. I need my law and order ringtone back on my phone. I don't know what, uh, that, yeah. what that was about just now. Um, also, before we go any further, I want to say rest in peace to uh, my man Rob, friend of the family. Y'all may know him as John from A Different Love. Oh, wow. Uh, oh. He's passed. He passed last week peacefully. Shout out to him. Love you, Rob. Uh, thoughts and prayers to Rob's entire family, loved ones, friends, all of that good stuff. We love mm-hmm. you, Rob. Uh, also, 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 there was something else before. Oh, uh, I want to shout out. I want to shout out to and round of applause to Salehi. I want to thank Salehi for the redesign of the network logo that you see on the bottom corner. Salute to him. Uh, what's up? Thank you. Always appreciative. And yeah, that was nice. 
He sent me some Crocs, but I like them shit. He sent me them Crocs. I text that nigga back. Yo, this shit feel like I'm walking to Gucci. <laughs> 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 Which Crocs you sent? Uh, the black joint. The black joint. Oh, the black joint. Yeah. I'm waiting on them peanut butter shits. Yo, them, my, peanut, them peanut butter salades. And they can start my, laughing the, like, y'all, that the, might the be the best joints. compliment I ever got. <laughs> you know? I can't wait for Soleil to come back here so we could really talk about my time at that GQ uh, party that him and I went to together. That was fun. Like going with like a fashion dude. You know, oh, he yeah, claims. That's, him. that's like Because he's that's really crazy. him, but he claims to be like us. Modest. Like, right, yeah, right. And modest. And my first time on the same dog. Nah. Dog. You can see through that. I'm really an introvert. Like the real kind, he and he heard. I heard on a podcast. You come to party and you go stay in the corner, but seeing it in real time, like man, you really yeah, nigga. We walk up. He walk walk right up to the velvet rope. They let him right in, like he was Denzel. Ain't ass check a list. No, they. I'm with him. I got to do. I'm with him. We, we walk walk right in there. Everybody is stopping him everywhere. It's a packed party. Nobody can move, and everybody's stopping him. And I'm the guy that's standing behind him. So it's the awkward. Hey, this is this is my this, friend Joe. Hey, this is my friend Joe. This is such and such. Hey, this is my man Joe. This is such and such. By the seventh, hey, this is I, yo. I don't give a fuck about none of this. <laughs> you, ain't gotta, you do not have to introduce. I'm gonna go be over there behind that plant, yo. <laughs> I'll be right there behind that plant. That oh, probably was a little I mean, interesting. Like, like no, it was you. funny. Yeah. yeah, yeah, probably was dope. Oh, oh it was no, funny for you to just be on the other side of that. That was hilarious. But some of the people in there know who you are, no? Uh, yeah, and they wanted me. <laughs> All right, got you. Condo, this, ooh, that condo. part, you better remember where you're at, nigga. <laughs> condo, huh? <laughs> Bigger than a condo. <laughs> <laughs> Pod number two in the new digs, you dig? Feeling good, feeling great. Don't worry, we'll eventually get the soundboards on the board. Get this shit. Don't try to put smut on my nigga Park's name. No, no, no. We, I mean, it's, we got this. We got this, sir. We got this. Y'all relax. relax. Let, us, let us cook. Let us cook. I'm going to get the plant going, some art soon. Yeah, you know I mean, let us get uh, acclimated properly. Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Oh, my God. The skyline's marvelous right now. <laughs> it is, though. The skyline is beautiful right now. Take a Take a peek. <laughs> Yo, we bid you adieu, farewell, peace, adios, arrivederci, au revoir, you know the fucking vibes. Also, oh, come on. life is a series of moments. Moments pass, so let's make this one last as if it's all we have. And last but certainly not least, the baddies are insecure, the stagnant women want to travel, when the closed-minded women want you to teach them things, grab a Tylenol, you might need it. It go, a. We'll be back, same time, same place, next week. And it go, how did I get next to you? Change the picture on them. It go. <laughs> shout out to Dixon, shout out to Simba. Shout out to Salehi. Shout out to Jersey. Big Jersey. Big Jersey. And that's it, man. Everybody enjoy their weekend. Do what you got to do to make it home and make it to Monday safe. And it go.